If you are happy that you are alive in the land of the living, can I see you be on your feet right now and appreciate the mighty God of Zion ministry for all his blessings and protections upon you in the month of January, in the month of February that is about to end. If you are happy that you are not ending this month in the mortuary, if you are happy that you are not ending the month in the hospital, if you are happy that you are not ending the month in the police custody, if you are happy that you are surviving the hardship in the nation, can I hear you make a radical joyful noise unto the Lord? Ona lo lo, ana wo. Please occupy your seats. Are you? Help me say to the person by your right side, you are welcome to today's program. And to the person on your left, you must surely be blessed today. Oh, now Zion, call them. Anna, wo. Anna, maka. Onya maka, obido gwenisi. Are you? Please settle down. Settle down wherever you are. We welcome everyone here for today's program. We welcome in a very special way those that are here for the very first time. We say a very big welcome to you in the name of Jesus. This is Zion Prayer Movement Outreach, a non-denominational ministry. Our days of activities are as follows. We gather here every Sunday for our Sunday fellowship that starts by 10 a.m. Every Wednesday we gather just as we have gathered today for our prophetic adoration program, which also starts by 10 a.m. Tuesdays are for pregnant and awaiting mothers, which also starts by 10 a.m. Our vigil holds every day online by 11 p.m., and that is the night of open heavens. We encourage everyone to not just be an OES member of Zion Ministry, but to identify with any group in Zion 
and become a registered member. We have so many groups here in Zion Ministry that you can join, like the Zion Fathers, the Zion Mothers, the Zion Youth, the Apostles of Christ, the Ambassadors for Christ, the Fruitful Vine Group, the Otimbu Jesus Group, the Zion Dancers, and the Zion Choir. Behind the crucifix, downwards, all these groups are well represented on their tables. You can go there to join any group of your choice. That is for those who are based in Lagos State here. To join any group is absolutely free. But for those who are based in outside Lagos, you can locate Zion in your place of residence. We are present in all the 36 states of this nation, Nigeria, including the Federal Capital Territory. So please do well to locate Zion wherever you are living. We are also present in all the countries of the world. Zion is global. So please do well to join any group of Zion closest to you. Please be well informed that indecent dressing is not allowed here in Zion ministry. Zion is a place of worship and not a social gathering. So you must dress properly before coming into the prayer ground. Our women do not wear trousers, mini skirts, or any other clothes that exposes the sensitive parts of their body. The same goes to our men. We do not wear neka or sleeveless into the prayer ground. And as a lady, if what you are putting on does not cover beyond your knees while sitting down, you are not allowed to occupy the front row of the seats. You can either make use of the back row or the security will help in relocating you. So please do well to comply with this to avoid having issues with the securities. From the media desk, please visit our website at zpmom.org. All our social media handles are there on display. You can also like our page on Facebook at ZPMOM. Also subscribe to our YouTube channel. We are also present on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok at Zion Prayer Movement Outreach Lagos. Do well to join us in any of these social media handles. And do not forget to put on your notification button so that whenever we come up online, you will join us from wherever you are. The use of mobile phones for taking pictures and videos while the program is ongoing is highly prohibited. That is to say, you are not allowed to camera anything with your phone while the program is ongoing. If you need pictures or videos of what will happen here today, or what has happened in our previous programs. You can always go to our media handles. Our media team releases quite a good number of them after each program, and you can go there to make your downloads. So please avoid the temptation of making use of your phone while others are praying, except on the occasions of adding the Lord giving the permission for people to do so. If you monitor me, you die sticker and so many other Zion stickers like I am too blessed to be cursed. Jesus and so many other Zion articles like the Odeshi calendar, the Odeshi hanky, the Zion frame with the logo of Zion ministry and the face of our daddy in the Lord, the effective prayer book, the liberation candle, the seraphic oil, the seraphic water, they are all available on sale. Some people are moving around with them. You can either buy from them or you go outside to meet those who are positioned on some strategic points. And there you can get your own prayer article. Also some musical CDs and talks of our daddy in the Lord. They are all available at a kiosk outside. You can go there to get your own. We encourage you to continue using the Zion articles for prayers 
because so many testimonies have been recorded from the use of these articles. So get one for yourself today and get ready for your testimony. If you want to redeem your old pledge or make new donations towards the development of Zion Ministry, you can always come by the right side of the altar here and meet with the Zion Committee or the Zion Accountant. And please make sure you collect a receipt for any payment you made. From our spiritual director, please be well informed that our daddy in the Lord does not private chat anybody on any social media platform soliciting for fund or asking you to partner with any motherless baby or to help a child that is dying of leukemia. This announcement is coming because our attention has been drawn to some online scammers who uses the name Zion Prayer Movement Outreach or Evangelist Ebukobi on social media to dupe some unsuspecting individuals of their hard-earned money. Some will go to the extent of making a video call with you. Some will be shouting you at the comment section even while the live program is ongoing, claiming to be our daddy in the Lord. After the long run, they will ask you to sow a seed or to go partner with a motherless baby or send you a picture of a child that is dying in the hospital, claiming to be in need. Before you know it, they will scam you of your hard-earned money. Please be vigilant and do not fall victim to these hoodlums. And also help us to sensitize everyone around you. Thank you for listening. Testimony time. We call on our first testifier. Zion, Zion, we move on our roll, go, go, oh, Zion, come here, man. I'm very happy to give this money, test money today. My name is Morris Many from River State, a chair local government to be precise. Last Year 100 days fasting and pray for divine settlement. While we were praying, my daughter, who goes to Pamo University Medical Science at Port Harcourt, came to me. She was then in her last year. They were preparing for their examination. So she came to me with some list including her own. Say, Daddy, please pray for us for this exam. I said, okay, what you have to do is for you to tell them, your classmates, to pray, to, to study hard and while we pray. So we came down for the crusade, for the seven days crusade, to mark the end of the 100 days fasting and prayer for divine settlement. And I wrote this, those names down, took it to the grotto, and placed it there, and bought a candle, and wrote the petition. And uh, we stayed here for seven days with this petition and other prayers. So after that, everybody went back to their states. We went home praying. On the 6th of, 6th of November, we went to the school, Pamo University Medical Science, for induction, nursing induction, into Nursing and Midwifery Council of Nigeria, where she graduated 
as a registered nurse, registered midwifery, registered public head nurse with first class. Her name is Choma Mini with first class. And I'm very proud of my daughter. Three of them made first class out of the rest. They all passed their exams. They all graduated, but she made first class. Check out the beautiful picture of my daughter. I, <laughs> I, <laughs> so the God of Ometerafancha, Okutirafancha, Ometerafancha, God of Zion, I've come to give this thanks to God. Thank you. Is that all you can do for this wonderful God of Zion ministry? You are the song that I sing today. You are the life that I live today. You are the season for the season today. There is joy in my life today. Marvelous God, now alone I'm worthy to be praised. Zion, we move. Okay. Now my testimony go like this. Okay, okay. My testimony go like this. My name, now for big where I come from a born state. On the local government. Okay. Like this. Okay. So <laughs> so I come from a born state on the local government. So my testimony goes like this. My testimony goes like this. Because <laughs> I know why you people are laughing. Huh? Okay. So at this last year, and my apparel. So we go go many ago. Like my my sister has go chara, my my brother has sent the chara myself. So the So we won't go now use the so the thing, all okay, them come. So all oh, oh, my brother was bad. I recommend them this Zion ministry. But I go so well join the Zion ministry. Now October 12th. So where be as the ever go to the that Sarafi Goy and Sarafi water. Buruka sign yeah. So yeah, come they use you see. So since then, till now. So about a half. So go so the thing. We say come back and Zion. You have a Zion. We move. Our brother here is thanking God of Zion ministry for divine healing upon his life. That he was suffering of severe pile. Each time he went to the toilet, all he passes out was blood. And that was a very big challenge to him. They went to several hospitals for healing, but it wasn't responding until the brother's wife brought him to Zion ministry here. He came here, bought the seraphic oil, took some sand from the ground of Zion, and that he has been using. Within a few moments, the whole thing disappeared. And today, he is totally healed to the glory of the God of Zion ministry. You can do better. You can do better. You can do better to appreciate this mighty God of Zion. In a merem de mumana roo, o de mumana roo, o de mumana roo, yo yo chimo. In a merem de mumana roo, o de mumana roo, o de mumana roo, yo yo chimo. Ezi chineke, chimle chimle, o yo yo chimo. Ezi chiyoba, chimle chimle, o yo yo chimo. 
My name is Uzo Chuku Christen. I'm from Cameroon. I'm married in Nigeria, Delta State. I come to the sleeper which God to die and do for me. I come to the sleeper which God do for me. Since eight years, my year, I know the year fine. Since eight years, I go many places, no work. Plenty church, no work. Last year, I, I decided to come uh, Zion Zion to come get healing. I come, I come with my daughter. I, uh, I buy uh, seraphim oil, water, seraphim water. After church, I turn back for house. I start uh, put the seraphim oil for my hair and uh, seraphim water. Since that time, my hair open. I want to thank. I want to thank God, Zion, God for Omochalafancha, Omechalafancha, what He do for us. Anna Agwo. That the ear she cannot use to hear for the past eight years. On getting to Zion Grand here last year, she bought the seraphic water and the oil and started using them as an eardrop. As we speak right now, the ears are open. She can hear very well. The God of Zion have done this. Somebody appreciate this mighty God of Zion. Mama Imela. Is Jesus? Every miracle and endota, Mamma Imela Chuko. Mamma Imela, is Jesus? Every miracle and endota. Zion, we move. Zion, we move. On our road, go, go. My brothers and sisters, I come here to testify what the Lord God has done for me. My name is Shooks A.K. from Omokabe Ogodongokwala local government in Imo State. I reside in United Arab Emirates, Dubai precisely. It happened in the year 2022. I have been in Dubai. I lost my job. I was terminated, and uh, I stayed more than one year without a job. Even to pay for accommodation became a problem. But I have a friend who is a brother, who is a Zionite here, who I went to stay in his place for a while. So during my time with him in Dubai, I was listening to the Zion, program. So I begin to love the Zion program. So for the period I stayed there for about one month, I told him, Chris, I have to come to Nigeria to Zion. He said, okay, but I don't have the money. So I took the risk. I had to borrow money. I took a flight. I left from the airport. I came straight here to Zion ground. So when I arrived Zion ground, I sat close to the crucifix here. But uh, Daddy did not locate me that day. But I said, since I have come to this ground, I prayed, I cried unto God. I went to the grotto, I tabled my case. I went to the crucifix, I tabled my case. I bought seraphic water, seraphic oil. I took the sand from here. For the past four weeks, I stayed in Nigeria. I made sure I was coming at least every week here. So in the month of August of that same faithful year, 
2022, I had to borrow money to travel back to the United Arab Emirates. On getting to the airport, I arrived safely. The day I arrived, my business partner, I never knew, he used my name to dupe people. He collected money from people and their passports. That same day I arrived, he left with the same airpiece airline and came back to Nigeria. So, as I arrived early in the morning, was resting, I received calls. I said, what is the problem? They said, the guy that I connected them to is not around again. They cannot see him. I rushed. We went to the police. They said they cannot do anything. We went to the airport. They begin to tell us the flights that have left that same day. So God so kind, we were able to track one of the airplane flights. So this was about 10 minutes to landing to Nigeria. So this brother has been there, you know, disguised himself so that he can escape. So I called on some friends who work in the airport. They said the CIDs cannot do this. So we have to call the DSS to assist. So during the problem, they said I have to pay some money before they can do that because it's an illegal job. I said, these people, if anything happens to their money, to their passport, four people's passports with their visas, I am in trouble because this man used my name to dupe them while I was not in the United Arab Emirates. So at the airport we were there, God so kind, the DSS guys were able to track him. They caught him five minutes of landing. And when they caught him, they didn't believe he's the one because the way he dressed and everything. But they searched his back. They saw four people's passport. This was how he was apprehended. And he was arrested. The God of Zion began to do something miraculous in my life again. The company that terminated me later started calling me that because of the Nigerian problem, they cannot give me a job, but they have to give me a contract. So they gave me a one-month contract. This one month, my brothers and sisters, became two months contract. Before you know it, it became five months contract. Before you know it, it became one year contract. Before you know it, the project finished. And they told me that I should wait. All the people that spoke evil against me were speaking good about me, and they said that they will call me back as soon as they get another contract. Onaroru. Thank you, Jesus. Can somebody celebrate this mighty God of Zion ministry? This guy God, oh. I never see your type. Oh. This guy God, oh. blessed be your holy name. Blessed be your holy name. This guy God, this guy God, oh. I never see your type. Oh. I never, I never. Oh. This guy God. Oh. Zion, we move. Zion, we move. On our Lord, go, go. My sisters and brothers, my name is Njinawa Boise Kamenus, AK. I'm from Imo State, Abombise. My testimony goes like this. It's a very long one, but I will try and make it short. Last year, my cousin introduced me to Zion Ministry. And before that time, you know, before last year, I've been having issues with my lungs and chest. I've gone to several um, hospitals. They will give me drugs and, and the thing will continue. Sometimes um, in the night, I won't be able to sleep. Because if I lie on the bed, you know, I'll be struggling to breathe. I won't be able to breathe. So I will sit, you know. Even at the point, I, I felt maybe I won't even last, you know. Um, I traveled home before the 100 Days uh, Crusade. So I went to visit one family. So there is a, a sister that came there. Um, 
she has her own grace, you know, in her own little way. So when we are praying, she said um, that God revealed my lungs to her, that my lungs are not good. I said, yes, I'm having issues. I said, yes, I'm having issues. She said, okay, okay um, when am I going back to Lagos? I said, I'm rushing back. I'm going for the crusade. She said, okay, um, I should try and see a doctor. But with her experience, for, for God to reveal this to her, that it, I may go to the hospital and, um, and they see nothing. So when I came back to Lagos, I went to my hospital again, to another hospital. So when I saw, I met the doctor, the doctor checked me and said, um, you know, I said, my heart is um, okay, my breathes are okay. So she, he now said I should go and do um, X-ray to check my lungs and my heart and um, do ECG. Then he said um, another thing that can cause it could be um, infection, that I should do full blood count. So which I did, and with all the results here, and with all the results, so when I brought the results to him, he said, my friend, your heart, your heart is okay. Your lungs is clear. Um, and you don't have um, any infection. I said, so I said, doctor, what could be the um, reason for this? He said that him too, that he's, um, he's confused, you know, that's, that's, um, that's nothing actually he can lay his, place his mind on. So he gave me, he gave me drugs. So when I returned home, I told my snow brother, he said, um, I should go to another hospital. I said, no, I'm not going to another hospital. So the drugs they gave me is still intact. I didn't, I didn't even open it for one day. So I came to here on that on, um, 100 days crusade. So on that faithful day, Daddy was um, doing a healing prayer. He said, uh, anywhere you are feeling pangs, hold that place. So I touch, I hold my heart and my lungs. So after the prayer, I went home. And I find out that those pangs, because that, before that time, I can't even touch my lungs. So I find out that those pangs have disappeared. And since that time, because before, before that time, I don't, I, don't, I don't sleep under a fan. I don't sleep under AC. If a little rain, my, my lungs will, will congeal. And since that time, brothers and sisters, I can tell you, I sleep under AC. I, use, I sleep under fan. So I want to return all the glory, all the honor to the God of our ministry. Zion! Oh. Itugo kwa chine ke Zion o mechara fancha. O mechara fancha. Ana agwo. Oner. Ona Zion konem. Chine ke keli kwe. Ezin nam ni gadi. Umogi sigi gawaniru. Oga ke moje monu. Oka kabini kwe. Chine ke keli kwe. Zion, Zion, we move. My name is Nkechinye Renwadike. I'm from Obaru local government, Anambra State. So I come to testify the goodness of God Almighty in my life. God Almighty healed me from my shameful sickness, bed waiting till my bed, till my, till from my childhood till now. But when I come to Zion last year, 
during the hundred years crusade, hundred days crusade, after the crusade and everything, I go home, I bought traffic oil and the water, started using them. From then till now, I have not got bed, uh, bed wetting again till now. So I come to thank God for the for healing over my life. Praise God. Is that all you can do for this wonderful God of Zion ministry? That she has been bedwetting since her childhood until last year, 100 days after the use of the seraphic water and the oil, the God of Zion delivered her. Somebody celebrates grace. Rejoice, okay. I'm from Imo State. I, I came here to testify. I came to testify on um, since I've been a child till up to now. I used to bed wet until last year, December. I met someone who gave me seraphic water, oil, and sand. I put it in my water to bed with it. So from that till now, I stopped bed wetting. That she has been bedwetting since her childhood until December. Somebody gave her seraphic oil, water, and the sand from the ground of Zion. And since then, she has been using it in her bathing water, and bedwetting have disappeared without stress. <laughs> I'm from United States of America, Chicago, Illinois. I Yes, 
manete nanya. Name ebere, na watch divine mercy. I watch night open heaven. I watch Tuesday program, Wednesday program, and Sunday program. I had the Ashemike, Mahmoud, and I'm neither a book, a mega im operation. Man, I go see my Bible. Now, go later. I was used off my BP name, BP madam, sugar madam, down, or dear high. I get him one year and I go to a goatee. Name is a size. Oh, my, I'm Mosinaga Horn. Han Rana window, Nelem, Hesset, I have a trend on Nigeria. Gam name is size. I hear she a meeker. And what he had named Yadia now. Okay, BP, Nadia. Yakom Nanti, boom. Elulala, and I will not buy him, he may not buy him, he may. On I have Messi Quam. Oh, when I made you the Yakagamada. I hear she a meeker. Nagazi. I got the hour, Bob. Oh, no, whom I'm not put on a baby or dicker. Oh, well, go to Naked Brum, two evangelists to Webcano Zubi. As I'm Chineke, young woman or one in Chineke goes there and goes in Nemonian, Renacobi, Navizan Toby, Ekelim, Nakel and Nadia Savage, Madame Nakel Penny. Sibicon. Onya wola ane buya ane buse, daddy ano. Onya waste the time. Enwe he game man. Chineke no hine ne. So chineke na gozi ere mi gozi ezinule. Oto si me ma o wa. I got the way I wa Bobby. Praise the Lord. Amen. Is that all you can do for this wonderful God of Zion Ministry? Itu go go chineke zayo no mechara fancha. No mechara fancha. Ana wo. Onere. Ona zayo ko neme. Our sister here is thanking God of Zion Ministry for divine healing upon her life. She's based in America, but over there, a lot of problems on her. The eyes were giving her so much problems that after the death of her husband, she was booked for surgery. But before then, one of the children connected her to Zion Ministry, even though she doubted initially, but at a time she gave in, and the first day she watched the program of her dad in the Lord, she fell in love with the activities of Zion Ministry and began to watch everything about Zion. She sent one of her sisters who is based here in Nigeria to get her the articles of Zion, the seraphic water, the oil, and some sand from the ground of Zion Ministry here. She started using them the BP that used to disturb her, the BP will be very high, and whenever it happens, she will feel so dizzy that she cannot control it. The BP disappeared. The sugar level that used to be high became normal. The eyes that was booked for surgery began to work very well like that of a little child. All the pains she used to receive all over her body that makes her bone to be weak as an elderly woman. But today, she's telling us that she's feeling as a young lady courtesy of the God of Zion ministry. Every sicknesses have disappeared. The God of Zion have done this. If your hands are not too busy, you can appreciate this wonderful God of Zion who have done this. <laughs> You know you have testimony you want to testify of what god has done for you in zion ministry please go behind the altar and meet with the moderators also be reminded that this coming saturday will be the deliverance day for the zion prayer warriors they will be conducting deliverance program 
this coming Saturday here on Zion Ground by 10 a.m. We urge and encourage everyone to come for that program. Thank you. Zion, we move. Zion, we, we move. Anna Awo. Onere. My name is Peter Abasiere. I'm from Anambla State in Okija, here at our local government. Here by me is my sister daughter. She came to stay with me. So I want to thank God for saving her from the hand of ritualists or kidnappers whatever they call themselves. Being on Saturday, on 10th on Saturday, so on the plan I had, the Gabafia, drop where you go, say I'm about to because no quadro. So on Gabafia, but as here around 9.30, Luton I had, I'm going to watch you the whole doors. So I follow me, I'm on my bono. So I'm going to be here, I'm going to be here, I'm going so, like one hour to the other about. Oh, I am not be at the lag, but I'm not quite the number, a busy number. So, more was out to my mom, so I'm not screaming, can I mean? Papa, my own phone, Papa, everybody, say I help one boy, should in case I'm only coming on whatever I got on my own, and I'm trying to So, towards that night, everybody from village, and I'm a corner where I will get on where I got. Even all their our brothers, sisters, neighbor, and they send the message in our phone. Yeah, all the message they send. So one of our sister, because the people kidnap the phone. So how they buy the message? So the sister forward me. I will say that now. Now I send their message again. Now forget where it is over. Can they weep and say, "Move away from us, you want my mommy to get me." So in the night, Mua be the baby bear, Muyas Lafi Kandu in my house. Where's the God of Zion? Abunebo, this God of Zion now no more here. In Kawa Blada, Ebuka, and Zobija Roro. Ever open, I call on a GDs, my sister Kahale is here. So after that prayer that night, because I could not sleep. So in the flowing morning, in Kawa Police Station. Second, I'm going to make entry. So, I'm going to make the same entry now. So, I'm going to ask you to send the number on the phone. That I should call that number. So, I'm going to call the number. I'm going to call those people who are going to pick the call. Same that now they are with my sister here. I'm going to call the phone. I'm going to call the phone. I'm going to call the phone. So, see, and na God of Zion will deliver you. So, what's if I have a police station? Can I have one dossier? Because more than a bad can be. Fire color, and I told you, Macahan, where you can get some of our kidnapped. So, why again? Zion, we move. Zion, we move. Anna, 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 Fuzi ye ne me seno anya iru anya di ko ni ibo gazi edi a jumi ye ne me so anya wa kwa zi edi a so na zi fa my number bomb because o give a ne me me chazi le biaru njo ba zi edi is my sister kaya ye me kose dat na na o gari bata da fuwe banye maroa so the next thing no ma zi abono so ebe mo tele abono e kotu so ebe nde a wa drop le the next morning a drop le outside nilo. So go be nitere with the phone here. How we go the sim card in the phone here? So one woman, boy, boy, and pussy, get it in here. See, I keep it here. Now I have my kids. I be in the my area. We like to go on your boat. So I be on my canozi. Before that, I will blow up the zi. Now zi have my number, boy, mo. We are saying that this my sister, and I have chopped her since. Now for here, now because now I have one Kujia, and police station, I have some number. No abalu li boga bi ana aga kweba ana a lot of expenses. Ni aga bori aga bana shop ya. So mbo gota zie kampi ke. Even those messages I send the chairi chamiya they suppose play the video. 
So we came to God as he called to Mfia. We are the God of Zion. Every male am this one because I want a man for the Aga and Angie, my sister, where go, where go. I'm not a man for Aga now. But I thank God after everything. God invigorates me. So I want to thank God for my child for saving her life. Anna, I go. Anna, I go. Our brother here is thanking God of Zen Ministry for saving the life of her niece here, who came to stay with her, him where he's based in Ibadan. That one day he left home and left her alone at the house, only for him to call the number of this sister later in the day, and nobody was responding to the call, unknown to him that some people have abducted her. And it happens that he went to the police station and made entry as they were calling the number and sending messages the kidnappers replied the message and asked them not to disturb anymore or they will kill her. And then our brother here was thrown into panic. All through the night of that day, he called the people in the east and informed them of what was happening. He prayed that night and called on the God of Zion ministry, begging that God of Zion should vindicate him. Because if anything should happen to her, the family will think that he has used her for money ritual or for something bad and as god of zion may have it the next day he received a call from a cartoon in lagos state here where they dumped her someone that they kidnapped from a pardon was found in a cartoon in lagos state here the god of zion made everything possible and today she's alive on heart to the glory of this mighty god somebody appreciate this god who has done this Chine karo ro mora gama gwa yo bodani ma juru mo ma jugi o kana de mo ko bo na ro bi e chuku mere mo bi e chuku mere mo no bi re baba chine karo ro mora gama gwa yo wani ne ma juru mo ma jugi o kana de mo ko bo na ro bi e chuku mere mo Zion, we move. Zion, we move. My name is Sister Akudoeze. I'm from Imo State. I want to testify to the goodness of God. Last year, after the singles program, our daddy in the Lord prayed for me. And after the prayer, God granted my heart desire. So, December 29th, I did my traditional wedding. And I also want to pray that God should answer all the single ladies here this year in Jesus' name. And I want to give God of Omechafancha, Okuchafancha, all the glory and adoration in Jesus' name. Thank you. On your screen is the video of the traditional marriage. After the singles program last year, single sisters, are you ready? Another singles program is coming very, very soon. Somebody celebrate the God of Zion ministry. Aye, this guy God, another one no deal. Aye, this guy God, another one no deal. Aye, this guy God, another one no deal. Zion, Zion, we move. I want to thank God for his mercy and love. Okay. 
over me and my family. I'm from Enugu State. My name is Theophilus Oka, Oji River, local government area. I'm based in the uh, UK. I came home this week. So during the brother Ebuka's open heaven, he always said, bring out your money for blessing. And anywhere you put this money, it will multiply. So I have a shop in UK. So always, I always bring out my money and for blessing. So as I continue doing this, um, I see my shop progressing, multiplying. Even my customers always testify that there's a great change in your shop. So before I know it, my shop began a mega shop. So that's why I'm here today to thank God and glorify his mercy and love. I thank you, the God of Zion. Zion. That is a video of his shop. Over there in the UK. Last year, when I was preparing to go for my law school, I didn't know that Zion Ministry exists. My husband called me that he wants me to go to Zion Ministry. And I asked him, where is the Zion Ministry? He directed me on how to come to the Zion ground. Luckily for me, there was a two days emergency program between March and April. So as God may have it, I came down to the Zion ground. Our spiritual director asked us to buy fruits and perfume. I bought those things. I came with them. He prayed for us that day, and I left. But before I left the Zion ground, I said, God, I'm preparing to go for my law school, and I don't want this, this my week this year to pass me by to the glory of God. May last year, I went for my law school. I was in law school when 100 years program started. I did my fasting prayer all through. Even during that 100 days program, I used to post our 100 days program into my various uh, chat groups. Many people, many of my colleagues joined me to the glory of God. When we closed the fasting prayer on August, by September 23rd, the result came out. And to the glory of God, I was among the successful candidates by, uh, by 11th of October last year, to the glory of God, I was called to the bar. I said, let me come and thank the God of Omechafancha for what he has done for me. 
That is our latest barrister. The God of Zion have done this. I got a hospital all this while. Now I'm a doctor. Doctor, I'm a prescribed arm drugs, but I'm not that now. Ovalorian 6 is a simple one. No question without any drugs. No, okay, they're very common. But for how many months? I'm going to go the hospital. I'm going to go to the hospital. Today, I'm going to go to the I'm not sure. That nam na ngo guone nyemu. Msi ya yes. Yes im no de hensho. Msi ya makagen. Yes im yon na hweba. Of Lorian 6. Moshi na de left. Ya ga na de right. Odi today one. Next month unga ya ba two. Osim gini ne me. Msi ya ma hamu. Ma si oke. The last one spent unga ra was December 27. So I decided that I know that I can be a Zion because I'm a trans Zion through online. And my neighbor will answer, I'm so always Zion. I say, okay. So yeah, do this January 12, I'm a So every day, I'm a baby, I'm a baby, I'm a baby, I'm a baby, I'm a baby. Although now daddy prophesies about my case online, but he would have daddy in his man. I your chukwa maras. Him mezu read that my scan results. Gawa na blessed sacrament in a one Catholic church in along the road. But why do I have a Catholic church? I know how direct I am. Me read about our red band. Si chine ke biko e we trele ngim pam. We read me ring home marage. So yeah, the one Tuesday I be read be. Oh, you know we read that the brochure. Or Sigi Bieba, no yobla will lay home by a scusa to Casara to Fobi, not watching a campfire. No way any neck and who daddy, no way any now. Who fall in the robin to Casabe daddy, no, not daddy, or would she neck when I go in your name? That day, I bet you, but I may feel low relief. So I am as a woo. Abasa, why am I woo? When Jenna sees you will be. My bear not the other side, yet to Samacana for Bechara may be. Malawa, and Mazona, and old Miri, Seraphic oil, and we're anointing oil, Nate in our form. So, all the lad, my disorderly, Massy, my sister, was Anotala, maybe Gawazebe, my sister, Abby, a bank, and she's in Abia. Massy, my sister, such a me gas can, oh, more mona, Gamna, of Lorian six, a man, no Hosea. Yes, I'm no Tom Shere, Marasia, don't worry. Come, go go this can. Come, my mask can on at watch. More hate you, him, they feel more was. When the magalanum scan. Oh, yeah, ma'am scan, see now. See, I be called a job for my other one, mama. Yes, now, ma'am, when who's of lawyer and six. Now, the two of remote, okay. Not the normal. Massa, are you sure? Yes, I'm yes. But now, little problem we are now. Now, I mean, where the problem now small of fiber on our baby, but I should avoid so many things. I will not allow it to continue growing. So, my baby, she can't kill it. Chuku maki yo me rim. I'm a little time get she call we a call. My doctor said, "I yeah, oh ma, I like her. I am now. I'm going to talk. My daddy want to walk. My mama get book home surgery. My see doctor, no, I can't go for surgery again. So, I'm a baby. I kill it. Chuku maki yo me rim." 
my yo mere msi se kele chi diri chi neke onye huru ihe ni ne we mezo ya chukwu o mechara fancha na o mechara fancha so kele diri ya zion ya abu scan results ngara ga cheke ya ya wuze na ya wuze na onwe of lawyer six onwe you can do better you can do better to appreciate the God of Zion who never gets tired of performing miracles. Are you? Mm. Our sister here is thanking God of Zion ministry for divine healing upon her life. That at a time she began to feel some pains in her tummy. She went to the hospital and it was confirmed to be ovarian cyst. Even though the doctor told her that is not a serious one that can be easily controlled. They gave her medicine. At the end of the whole thing, she went back for a checkup and was told that the ovarian cyst has become double. Instead of the single one they were seeing before, it was double again. And as they were continuing the treatment, the whole thing was becoming worse. At a time, someone directed her to Zion Ministry, even though she has been following online. But because of this problem, she decided to come here in person last year. And after her encounter with the God of Zion ministry, through the use of the seraphic water and the oil, and some prayers by the ministers of the ministry, she has gotten her healing. She went back to the hospital. The result we have here is saying that the ovarian cysts have disappeared without the aid of any more drugs, but the seraphic water and the oil. The mighty God of Zion have done this. Somebody appreciate this God of Zion. You are the Lord that is your name. You will never share your glory with anyone. You will never share your glory with anybody. Almighty God, that is your name. You are the Lord that is your name. You will never share your glory with anyone. Share your glory with anybody, Almighty God, that is your name. Zion, Ramon. my name is Erazwa uh, Faith TV from Edo State. I want to thank God for the life of my child. When I gave birth to her, she was very fat. He gets on stage, no matter what I give her to eat, she will look very, very slim. She don't have weight. So the thing keep bothering me. I cried most times when I see my baby, because it's not what I expect. I know when I was pregnant for her, they told me that she would be very, very fat. So when I give birth to her, things changed. Until last year, during open heaven, Daddy was praying, said, put your hand on where it's paining you. I didn't even bother for myself. All I care is about my child. Because I was crying down at God, I'm tired of this. Giving her food, buying this, it will not even show her body. She look like a baby that I don't used to eat. So that night, Daddy said, place your hand on where it's paining your baby or you. So I put my hand on her legs, on her hand, because she cannot even stand very well. She used to squat and stand. But the thing bothers me. That after that prayer, daddy said, raise your water up. And he prayed on it. That night, as my baby woke up in the middle of the night, I gave her water to drink. In the morning, behold, my baby poo-poo bead from her husband. Bon. Later on, she gave her the water again. She poo 15 bead from her husband. Bon. I give God the glory. On your screen now are the beads that she passed out after taking the seraphic water her daddy prayed over during the night of open heaven. Since then, my baby eats very well, and she's adding, and everything changed. I come, I come to give God the glory for what he did for my baby. But if it is me, I have no money to take my baby to surgery or anything. I'm grateful to God. Zion, remove. Zion.
Zion. We move. On our Lord. Go, go. My name is Harrison Tochukumo Ojiji. I'm from Ebony State. Last week, my testimony goes like this. Last week, Wednesday, I'm going to work because our night is, uh, our work is night work. So I entered Moto, start going walks. So we meet Amroba on the road. Said they attacked me, collected all our property that we have inside the Moto. So as one of them said I should come out, and I come out, said I should lie down. I lie down. He started using cutlass on me, cutting me. After beating me with the cutlass, he started cutting me with the cutlass. As he raised the cutlass up again to cut, one of them said I should run. Then, by then I move, I start running. I don't know that they cut serious wound in my hand self. As I run, I can't see the blood through my clothes. Then I touch where that is paining me. I can't see that they wound me seriously. Then, by then, they don't leave my driver, say that sh they should go. So the driver meets me on the road and take me to the hospital. From the hospital, my boss come meet me there and they give me treatment. Then he take me back to Lagos. I just come here to thank the God of Zion for saving my life today. Jesus of Ugiwaka. Jesus of Ugiwaka. Jesus of Ugiwaka. Jesus of Ugiwaka. My name is Agito Ochiku, I'm from Ebony State. So, I come here on Wednesday. After Wednesday, which Thursday night, I have a dream when someone is pressing me. So I was struggling for that dream that, how, just, I was struggling, struggling, struggling. I just now shout, Jesus, Jesus. So when I, when I just stand up and I took Safari uh, oil and the uh, water, and and I use the uh, safari oil and water to wash my face. So since that time, the thing stop. We can't reach, we can't reach on Thursday. We can't reach on Friday morning. My one hand like this, I cannot move one hand by by my right hand. I cannot shake the hand. So and I can't uh, wonder what's happened. Where all these things happen to me now? Well, now when I'm coming to Zion. So God of Zion, please heed me. I need, I need to, to be delivered. So I now reach out, can use oil and sand to bath. So reach on Monday night. I was watching television from my house. So I now feeling pains from my head. I now feeling pain. I can't, say, can't find drug for inside. Prasamo. And time is late. I cannot even go out again to go and buy drug. And I sit down again. Just they say, God, I beg. I don't know what is happening to me now. Before I know it, so, and I stand up. I can't see blood from my nose. I saw, I saw blood. And I enter inside the toilet. I cough. I see blood. I cough. I see blood. So, I bend down like this for the toilet. I see blood. They think, oh, they rush. They rush. And I called my sister. My sister, no picking call. I called my mom. My mom is picking up. My mom is... It's not picking call. So later, my mommy can't call me. At times, I don't know what is happening to me. Oh. My, I don't, they vomit blood. 
blood is coming out, come out from my nose. And when we come ask me whether did I call my sister, I say, yes, but my sister is not picking call. And I go and kneel down for where I normally pray in the night. I have small water where I normally pray. Can they call God of Zion? Can they call God of Zion? Please hear me. God of Zion, please hear me. So the blood is coming out from my mouth. And even though all my clothes where I wear is blood, they can show you now the video where I'm calling God of Zion and the picture. So, so. so it reached yesterday morning, my sister called me, say I should go to the hospital. I said, no, I cannot go to the hospital. God of Zion is already killing me. So what I will do is that today I will come to God of Zion. There is there another hospital I can go, can heal me, than God of Zion.
thank God for life. Um, for those of you, a few months ago, like seven to eight months ago, I had an accident uh, where I went to play football. So I did something that is very small that you will not take for anything results for me to do surgery. And which I did the surgery in Igbobi. 
I think the picture and the video we played on the screen um, for now. So on that, after the surgery, I went through pain. The pain was so severe. I was using crushes to walk because I cannot walk. I was staying one place for the past seven to eight months. And those of you that used to see me here in Zion, I used to use crushes. And the pain was so severe that I cannot do anything. And I was crying every day in my house. I've been crying every day, every night. All of a sudden, one day, I have to connect my phone to watch um, Daddy on live program. That was on Tuesday program. While I was watching Daddy, Daddy was praying for people that were in pain because the pain was so severe. As daddy was praying, I laid my hand on that same place I did the surgery. And I was praying to God, crying that God should help me let this pain go off. After that program, I slept off. I didn't know how I slept. On it, I got a trance where daddy came in my sleep and touched my leg in three places. Touched the places I had the wound. And when I woke up, up to today, from that day to today, I could not find that pain anymore. As you can see me now, I don't know what this is not on the screen. As you can see me now, I'm walking without crushes. It's kind of strange now. That is his condition when he had the accident, that the legs were broken. That is his condition in the hospital. But today, the legs are completely healed. So, after that, um, I've been looking for visa to travel to U.S. since uh, 2021. And I've been finding this visa for a long time. And I told myself, how can I be, they call me, how can I be Zion person and I'll be stressing myself for visa. So I took my passport to come and meet our daddy, Evangelist Chukwe Bukan Oziobi, to tell him, daddy, I want to visit U.S. Let me just go for some time and return. So daddy looked at me and asked me, okay, where's your passport? So I gave daddy my passport, and daddy opened the passport. All daddy did was to blow breeze on it and close it. So, <laughs> so as daddy closed it, my mind was like, ah, I was expecting daddy to pray. Or the other side was telling me, shut up, it is done. So I took it, I came to the altar, I came to wave it to God and thank God for giving me the visa. I went to the interview. If those of you that have gone to the U.S. interview, you know how tough it is. I was standing on a queue, up to 40 people on that same line. There's this lady that what she does is she will be denying people visa. I was on that queue. She had denied 39. I was the number 40. And I was praying that, oh God, I beg, shift me, go the other line. That same line that I was praying for God to shift me to did not work. The security had to tell me to come in front of the same lady. So I looked at her. Meanwhile, I remember that he had blow breeze. So the way that he covered the passport, that is how I gave her the passport. And she opened it. She looked at me. The next thing she asked me is, how long do you intend to stay in the U.S.? <laughs> so I said... I intend to stay in 14 or 17 days. She said, okay, what do you do? I told her I'm a comedian. She asked me of my handle. I told her. And the next thing is, your visa has been approved. Just like that. That it did not end there. Now, after she told me my visa had been approved, I went home to go and take my passport. I heard they used to give two years visa. I said, oh, two years is okay for me. I collected my passport. Behold, they gave me five years. I don't know how it happened. So this is my visa. Uh, very soon, I'll be traveling any moment from now out of the country. It's all, it's just all going to be, it's here. Oh, no, no, no. Ebu be zayo mini sure kulie. Ebu be wano zobi. Ebu li tu sato. I'm 
Chineke Zion, O Metarafancha, O Metarafancha, Anna, Anna Zion, Gonem. Please settle down on your seats. Zion! Zion! We move. My name is Chiamaka Madu. I'm from Imo State. Or oh, right, not precisely. So I'm here to give testimony on behalf of my sister. Two years ago, my sister was pregnant and a lot of battle came though. And in the process, the doctor told her that the baby in her womb is dead. So miraculously, she was able to give birth to the baby. Then I've, I've not known Zion. I don't know about Zion. So last year, she got pregnant again. So after that, a friend of mine introduced me to Zion ministry. So I kept on praying to God, God of Zion, telling him that, please, I don't want this nonsense to happen again. I want my sister to have another child. So in the process of praying, on the 13th of December, 2023, that dimension my sister's name. Praise the share about you right now. There's somebody called Juliet. You're pregnant. Juliet, you're pregnant as I'm talking now. You have lost a child before. Juliet, Juliet, pregnant. This one will not die. This baby will not die. You will have a child and your child will live. Juliet, your baby will live. I destroy every demon of death hovering around you. I destroy by fire. I destroy by fire Amen. in the Holy Ghost, hey. Holy, Ghost. Hey. Holy, Ghost. Hey. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, hey. Holy Ghost, hey. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, the Holy Ghost. Hey. So after that, I, I saved the video, I sent it to her, and she watched it. I told her to keep on praying um, with the video. So on the night of February this month, my sister gave birth to a bouncing baby boy. Can somebody celebrate the mighty God of Zion ministry? That is the picture of the baby. Zion is all over the world. Join me as you welcome the great prophets of our time. I see that you Our daddy is here. Chuku kere ya kera mama Oyo bola chulia kaliri Hebu kabi gadele leno Ajeha Ine chone Ine chone Ine chone Ine chone Ine chone Ine chone Uwaze ya la buga noriri Ochiri ya kageli Uwaze ya la I'm gonna get 
Nandine, Nandino Yagaru Rugano Nibu, Macho Kuchura Junelo, Chubu Kero Yemani Fogabu, Chubu Kero Yakira Mamandelo, Mamosayoni, the way the Liga Liga Liga. Are you happy? Yes, sir. Are you sure you are happy? Yes, sir. 
Hold somebody's hand and lift it up. Well, you come, mother, Body, back, front, everywhere. The camera people. Well, yeah, Kelu Nazo. As you lift this hand up, I'm not why any other day is not sad. I don't know where I'm up with you on that one. Can we say much on we bazua? Brand, I'm a mapari apara. Up, 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 For those that believe that God is not working, Abuja people say they are coming to testify. So many people, their ear is still opening. Their eyes, cancer vanishing. Are you cool like a ribia? Well, you are catching a kelo. I don't believe in story. I've been saying it. My vocation is not story. I believe in signs, wonders, and miracles. Because the Bible says in Isaiah 8, 18, I and the children who God has given me, we are for signs and wonders. And the kingdom is not by story. Kingdom is by power. If I am ministering and things are not happening and people are not testifying, I will drop the microphone. Because Hebrew 13 verse 8, Jesus is the same yesterday. Jesus is the same today. Jesus is the same forever. I don't believe in long story. Thank God for the gift of prophecy with instant solution. I know queer, you know, we're on air, man. Well, yeah, Kelu, as we have gathered together in one accord, these 20 days is to attack any negativity in your family roots. Amen. Any cause in your family, as you have abandoned everything to be here today. Today, your family testimony has started. Amen. I you well in Akelu that as you are here, you represent your family. Mawai, Mawoke, you are representing your family. Kebe Chungi Kena, I take what I'm pitch of family Mubwa. No, is a open prayer for your family. Looking at your brothers, are you happy? Looking at the way your family is, are you comfortable? No, sir. This 20 days is to tell the Lord, please, you have to do something. This time around is no longer, please, oh please, oh please. We are taking it by force. Whether the devil likes it or not. Yes, sir. Grasshoppers died in the belly of chicken. I have come to understand that for you to survive in this generation, as it is now, for you to survive, you must be fearless. You must be strong. 
The Bible says, for the spirit you have received is not the spirit of divinity, but the spirit of boldness. You must be strong. You must be courageous. You must have a courageous mind. I hear you, sir. Am I communicating? Yes, sir. Only yes, thing I'm giving you is seven days. You say seven days is too much. I give you three days. After this program, you are going to repossess your possession. Hey. Hey. Any attack on your family, see, saw this why. As we have declaring this day open, many families that no one has ever celebrated. From now, there will be canopy of celebration. Hey. Hey. Anybody that will rise against you will go down. Hey, hey. Shake that body and shout fire. Yeah, 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 yeah. When you are as your hands are lifted up, let the enemies of your family begin to fall. Amen. Before 20 days, we want to hear a news in your village. Amen. Any evil uncle, evil madam, evil landlord, Fire. evil landlady, Fire. evil neighbor, Fire. that person within this time we go down. Hey. Hey. Some of you will receive a call Amen. that that man don't die. Hey. Hey. Some of you will receive a call that she's dead. Amen. I hear you, sir. Anybody that is planning for you to die all this while, this time that person will go down. Amen. Amen. Fire. The key your mom, he says, is the will of God. Your father died, he says, is the will of God. Your brother died, he says, is the will of God. Your brothers that are beating house, they have stopped. He says, is the will of God. You must take it by force. They must know that your family have somebody like you. Yes, sir. They must know that your family have somebody like you. Yes, the highest mistake they have made is by allowing you to know Zion. Yes, sir. Well, you And yet, well, you are Amen. Yes, and in these 20 days, will attack any man or woman Dangerously that is working against our ministry. Amen. Amen. So many of them will be on sick bed. So many of them attacking us will begin to receive our come on the sick bed. Amen. From now, this family you come from must M U S T. This family must prosper for the first time. For darkness can cover the whole nation. As darkness has covered Nigeria. But upon you, light will shine. Amen. So it doesn't matter eh, that one bag of rice is 100,000, 85,000. We know that it's not good, but you will survive this time. Amen. Leave that time and shout, my family must survive this time. My family must survive this time. Amen. Because there must be a remnant in Zion. Oh, when they are for no noble, I am shot. Everybody will not die. May you be among them that will survive. Amen. Do you agree with what I said? Yes, sir. Leave that time and chat seven hotels. Amen. 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 Use your two hands and hold somebody's neck. Use your two hand and hold somebody's neck. Shake that neck. Tell that person, you must survive this time. You, you must, must survive, survive this time. time. Now, take all that person. Take all 1,000 people. Take all 1,000 people. <laughs> take all 1,000 people. May I matter 2,000? See how you must survive this time. Take 
Tico, Tico, Tico. Tico, 1,000 people. Tico, Mozaga. Tico, Mozaga. Tico, Mozaga. Tico, Be the first to see that. There is no prayer today. Today is the first day. Only what we do today is testimonies. You will come down now. Let's continue with the testimony. Zion, move. Zion, Krista. move. My name is Hajunus Okuchuku Amarakwe. I come from Ezinifte, Umez Kelebo in Lewis South local government area, Anambra State. What brought me here is the prophecy the man of God gave about me on the third day of uh, this 21 days uh, uh, pro program he made on Janu January. So what he gave about me is that before the prophecy, I was down. I'm not getting up. I have so many sickness in me. And I'm wretched, more than wretched, more than poor, until the prophecy come that day. That somebody call Hygienus, you're a minister of God. You are being mocked every day. They laugh at you. In fact, your business collapse. People laugh at you. And people say, ah, if this is this way people carry their Bible, I would not like to worship your God. You are doing business with people, but you carry Bible, you preach Jesus. You are not hiding it. You are a born again, a minister of God. Right now, you are doing nothing. The business collapse. Attack from the east, west, and south. Your source of income collapse. People are laughing at you. Mali Bragada. But that is not even the mention. The Lord, the angels provoked. Because right now, you are even sick. No money again in the business to even feed 
now you are done the bracata there is somebody that attack you when you remove something from the village there's something you removed. They attack you. They got you down. This person called Hajunus. As we are worshiping God tonight, I don't know whom you are, but your yoke will be broken tonight. Amen. Your yoke is 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 broken tonight. Amen. There will be double miracle for Hajunus. You are going to be healed tonight from your sickness. Amen. And I see the Lord restoring you. Amen. I Jesus, I set you free from your head to toe. Amen. I command the yoke upon you to be destroyed. Amen. In the Holy Ghost. Fire. 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 The Holy Ghost. Fire. So that's the prophecy. What happened is that uh, we have a deity in our kindred. We own check, by our check, people. Check, check. So me and the other brethren, we decide we decide that yeah, because it's not working. I want a deity. I don't say anything. So we decide that we, that I don't must be removed. Okay. We meet people, our people. We meet the brethren with the other brethren. They agree that we will do it. We invite one of God to come and remove it. He came and take that in away. Clear everything in that bush. Carry everything out. But unknown to us that. That hall, there's a hall where we are praying. We make a covenant. We, we pray every January. We have some assembly. We call people. We pray. That's every second January of every year. But that hall where we are praying and feeling, that's a very big box. And that box is another of four. That is the symbol of authority of that deity. You see there. We say we must, it must be removed. We went to the elder, person, elder man in our community, the owner of the custodian of that of four. That we want to remove it. Before they were made man of God, they say we should go and tell them. We we'll tell them that we want to remove that thing. That they can't be there. We'll be worshiping God under that or for, on, the, on the ceiling. They say we should go and remove it. We go to the man. He say we should go and remove it. Because we tell we give him two options. If he does not agree for us to remove it, we we'll carry it to his house. Then keep it with him. He'll be sleeping with it. He say we should go and remove it. I went and bought a big Bible according to the instruction of the man of God. And give him. He put it in the church altar. One of the can church. Then after that, he put us to the church, to the place, and burn that off, or bring it out and burn it. Two, two. So keep that Bible. On the door of our meeting, say we should come and carry it. Go and collect the Bible. Give them at the meeting. They carry the Bible two, and give to the elderly man. Say, this is our for now. No, no, no more that stick. They put foul head and so other nonsense two, that uh, no. That this is what we'll be using as our for now. If we come meeting, we'll bring that Bible and read it. Any chapter, any verse on it. It become our for. So great. But after that, after that day, this is not since changed. Everything about me. I'm a wedding man. I have trackers. All of them I sold them. My business collapsed. Everything about me goes to the ground. I'm beyond beyond poverty. I cannot feed. Two. I cannot even pay my house rent. Nothing. My children's school fees is a problem. Two. Two. Anything I put in my hand, it will collapse. If me and you do business now, you will shop the you will eat the money and nothing will happen. This thing continues happening since Two. Days, Two. almost ten years now. So the thing is happening every time. I've sold everything I have. Then after, after the prophecy, I was done before the prophecy. After the prophecy, I get up. In, in me now, I have diabetes. I have uh, stroke. I have well, everything, every sickness. But all of them have cleared. See me now. Is it not me that's standing up now? I travel from Enugu. Before, I cannot walk from here to that place. But I travel from Enugu to this place yesterday morning. And this is my first time I'm coming to Zion. Is that all you can do for this wonderful God of Zion ministry? Somebody celebrate the God of Zion ministry. Chimuch and Guinea Abia, two of you should come. After this program, I want to see the moderators. What is his testimony? Oh, Abia. Give somebody a high ten. Today is the beginning of these 20 days. Only what we have today is testimony. Anywhere you have a Jason Deering, Oko. Amen. Kuposia Hanya. He will bro Dogu before Easter. Amen. Kwen Wanyang Akando Dogu. 
Boy, you dog we them. Boy, you only seen that zagger. Only seen that zagger. Let's listen to the clearance of this testimony. I didn't hear the voice well. Ungwa. Are you? Our brother here is thanking God of Zion Ministry for saving him from the disaster that befell him after going to their village deity. That he used to be a born again Christian who believes in Christ other than the deity that the whole village was serving. There is a hall in their village where they gather every second of January to pray every year. So it happens that in that hall is also where the pagans gather to worship the deity of the whole community. Then he approached the village head that they cannot be serving God under the same canopy of the pagans where they serve their own deity every year. So he brought the proposal of them removing that deity. Many elders declined to that request but he went ahead with some prayer group to go there, scatter the whole shrine, remove the deity, including the symbol of authority of the deity, which the Igbo people call or for, that is, is a piece of stick that they used to represent the idol. And after that incident, it happens that the whole attack landed on his head because he was the one that championed the movement and his business began to crumble. At a time, someone that had fleet of cars in his garage, houses everywhere, the business that was doing well, everything Chick. crumbled, Chick. that he became poorer than the poorest Chick. of the poor. Chick. And feeding became Chick. a problem, Chick. that even to feed or to pay house rent became a serious Chick. problem for him. But someone linked him up to Zion after seeing what he was passing through. He was only watching online until this faithful day during the 21 days, and that in the Lord mentioned his case. And before that time, he was very down with sickness as a result of the same attack from the deity and the evil men that disagreed for him to remove the deity. He was very down in the hospital with diabetes, with strokes, so many sicknesses. He was hospitalized the day that this prophecy was coming through. But after that prophecy, he's telling us today that the whole sickness has disappeared and his business is gaining weight gradually to the glory of God of Zion ministry. Can we watch that prophecy again? Now, nah, oh God, you say today is your first time coming to Zion? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. You are coming to yesterday, Zion? Yesterday was the first time. But like, I traveled from Enugu to here. You came from all the way from Enugu? Yes, sir. Where in Enugu? Uh, living at number three, Ojo to Crescent, Transekulu. You heard the prophecy? Yes, somebody sent me the link from London. From London? Yes. Let's watch it. I know you quick one. I know you quick one. Then somebody call Hygienus. You're the minister of God. You are being mocked every day. They laugh at you. In fact, your business collapses. People laugh at you. And people say, ah. If this is the way people carry their Bible, I would not like to worship your God. You are doing business with people, but you carry Bible, you preach Jesus. You are not hiding it. You are a born again, a minister of God. Right now, you are doing nothing. The business collapsed. Attack from the east, west, and south. Your source of income collapsed. People are laughing at you. Mali Bragada. But that is not even the mention. The Lord, the angels provoked. Because right now, you are even sick. No money again in the business to even feed. Now you are done. The Bragada. There is somebody that attack you. When you remove something from the village. There is something you removed. They attack you. They got you down. This person called Hygienus. As we are worshiping God tonight. I don't know whom you are. But your yoke will be broken tonight. Amen. Your yoke is 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 broken tonight. Amen. There will be double miracle for Hygienus. You are going to be healed tonight from your sickness. Amen. And I see the Lord. 
do restore in you. Amen. I Judas, I set you free from your head to toe. Amen. I command the yoke upon you to be destroyed. Amen. In the Holy Ghost, 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 the Holy Ghost. Andy, and I could watch you like a monster. Prophecy with the instant solution. solution. Do you say you have cars before these things? But you have cars. A cars. I have cars. I'm a well-known man in Portacot. I live in Portacot. Huh? I live in Portacot. I'm a well-known man in Portacot. I do business. I do contracts to companies. But when this thing starts, everything crumbles. Everything crumbles. From it's my father in law that took me to Elugu. I was living in Portaco. He just took us to Elugu last year. The woman cannot parent it. And you're on the sick bed when this prophecy came? Yes. Did you see the man of God to tell him your name and your case? I've not even heard about you. Eh? I've not even seen you. Somebody, I don't even know about Zion. I prophesy you are old. I receive it. Oh, man, son, Yes, sir. If you know the hear voice, there are people whom God has given the gift of hearing voice. It's not magical, it's divine. Oh, but remember eight years. I do know so. Oga hai Do you know why I'm calling you Oga? He said that after carrying the date, everything is scattered. You were living. Why I'm calling you Oga is because you are going back to be Oga. Amen. He said he was on the sick bed. That prophecy came and he stood up. When they gave him the, 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 the from Enugu, where is your village? I from Umwez Kelebo, Umudiala, in Ezinifelok, Ezinifelok, South Local Government Area. Near we South? Yes, sir. But you are Anambra, no? Yes, Anambra State. But you based in Enugu? I based in Portacot. My father in law take us to Enugu where we cannot do anything again. Oh, your father in law brought you to Enugu? Yes, he take us to give us a house in Enugu. When the hunger was wiring you, yes, sir. get ready for restoration. Oh, yeah, Ghana, but prophecy with instant solution. Jam your hands for the Holy Ghost. You are set free in Jesus' name. Amen. After the program, they will bring you to me. God is faithful here. God is ever faithful. There is nothing we... Today is opening of the program, right? We only testimony today. Tomorrow, I am able to fork. The fire from this altar will scatter any evil altar in your village. Hey. Yeah. For the first time, before Sunday, some people will begin to have stroke. Amen. Ngwa. <laughs> Let's hear the testimony. Please, all those that testified before the arrival of our daddy in the Lord should come behind the altar. Those that gave testimony before daddy arrived, please come behind the altar. Thank you. Zion. Move. Zion. We move. I want to... My name is Chidima Richard. Well, friend, my friends do know me as Chi Baby. So I'm from Abia State, you know, being a local government. On Saturday, at my place of work, I'm a chef. So, like, all of a sudden, I was working and I didn't know what really happened. I started noticing something was moving around my body, and at night, I can't even sleep well. I was just managing myself to cook that very day. So at the end of the day, I was able to go to the pharmacy and to get a drug. So when I took the drugs, the drugs helped me a bit, but it wasn't as if I was okay. But getting on Sunday was getting worse. I was praying with my seraphic oil. I was saying, God, I cannot die, you, that you should save me. So on Monday, on Monday night, open heaven, before the open heaven, I took my seraphic oil. So daddy called my name on open heaven. 
Holy Ghost, 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 as somebody that call you she baby they know you as she baby you are having terrible moving objects what they call you is she baby something is moving around your body it's moving like snake based on this you cannot sleep you're having sleepless night she baby i don't know whom you are that is why you must press this share button you must send the link across that somebody somewhere can be rescued that somebody can be delivered and somebody case cannot be mentioned and that person remained the same Mary Baba Kenderima, even as you are joining even if your uncle did not mention you are not going to remain the same uh, this person called she baby you are having a moving object you are sleepless you are having sleepless night uncomfortable person like you because of this moving object but tonight I don't know whom you are I command whatever negatively moving around your body to die Amen. projected inherited no matter where it comes for I command it to scatter by fire Amen. in the Holy Ghost. Fire. 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 Fire. The Holy Ghost. Fire. Initially, before now, the doctor said that I was going to go for S3 to do a checkup to know what is wrong with me. In me, I was like, I'm not going for the checkup. So that Monday night, I was so happy. Instantly, I got my healing, and I noticed that what was moving around my body was no longer there. I could feel comfortable. I could sleep well. You can do better. Anna, what? Anna, Zion, go Zion, I ye 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 ye. I On our Go, go. On 2000, 2013. Okay. My name is Okreke Chigozie. I'm from Ayazu, Imo State. On 2013, I was in school. So I felt sick. The sickness took me to so many hospitals. I was carried to so many hospitals. But on a long run, I got healed. But before the sickness, I developed an, an eye problem that was disturbing me. The eye problem was so severe. I was passing through severe pains every blessed day. To the extent that I go to hospital, eye clinic every month. I was moving from eye hospital to the other, from one doctor to the other. They were prescribing eye drop from one eye drop to the other. I was changing eye drop like as I'm changing clothes. So, on two, I don't know, I don't know about Zion Ministry. Three, 2013, a priest friend told me about Brebuka, about Zion. He said that I should join. I, felt, I, I, I met him at his parish. At that night, we joined Zion Ministry, uh, uh, Zion, that very day. So on that day, after praying uh, at open heaven, I left. So the same sickness was seriously disturbing me until one day, one afternoon. I don't know that Brebuka used to do divine mercy. So I was going through my phone, flipping through my phone. So I, I saw the program, Divine Mercy was going on. So I knelt down, I was, I was passing through severe pains that very day. Like now, I can't fix then, I can't fix my eyes on the sun. I can't try it. I was applying eye drop every minute of the day. Like in a day, I can apply eye drop 10 times. So, Brebka, on that day, I knelt down, I was following the Divine Mercy. I knelt down, I was, for the sake of the sorrowful passion, I was following, I said, have mercy on us and on the whole world. And I was passing through pens that very day. On, on no only, Brebuka called, mentioned my name. <laughs>
There is somebody called Chigozie. You are about to lose your sight. Chigozie, are they talking about cataracts? When I think like this, happening, you begin to clap for God. I don't know whom you are. That eyes is getting bad. Gozier, that eyes, your eyes is getting bad. You don't even have money for whatever, for the treatment. As young as you are, you are becoming blind. I don't know whom you are, but this is altar of solution. We are impossible, made up possible. The altar of prophecy with the solution. Gozier is going blind. I don't know whom you are. The two eyes, the two eyes are affected. You are struggling to see and you are young. Mm -hmm. Let the mercy of the Lord come down upon you. Let the mercy of the Lord come down. In Jesus' name. Let the mercy of the Lord from heaven come down. Let the mercy of the Lord come down. Laga mama mama shana la mama kete li mama ke. Rakete sakadra mama koto shenala mama kege de libra Rakato sokoto sekete le mama shakata la mama keke to libra Libra gado shanala bakete There is intervention of the Holy Ghost Amen. Upon your eyes Amen. Intervention of the Holy Ghost Amen. To receive your healing Amen. Exodus 15 26 He is the Lord that healed thee Exodus 23 25 He will take your sickness away Peter 2 24 By his wounds you are Heal Matthew 8 17 by his stripes you are healed Isaiah 53 1 to 4 by his wounds you are healed let's go back to our God if he has wounded us he will bandage us by the power bestowed upon me as the servant of Yahweh because I declare you here that you may come to Zion for testimony Amen. let the angels of healing begin to visit you right now Amen. for many have received their testimony money online mm. now you are receiving your own you are yoke is broken Amen. your yoke is broken Amen. the yoke of that sickness is broken Amen. I don't care to know the name they call it uh. there is only one particular name that is above every other name and at the mention of that name every nation bow you on behalf of Gozier and the rest of him having the same case I call that name that is above cancer I call the name that is above cataract I both I call the name that is above any man or woman and that name is J E S U S C at that moment I went to my drawer picked all my eye drop went to the trash and trashed it from now, from that very day, I have not applied any eye drop. I have not feel any pain in my eye till today. I am thanking God for using Brebuka to heal me. Hi on Can somebody celebrate the grace of God in Zion ministry? Make a radical joyful noise unto the Lord. Zion, we move. Zion, we, we move. move. I thank God today for making me to be here. My name is Oyamadi Obina. I'm from Anambra State, Okanot. I want to testify what brought me here actually. Yesterday was my first time of coming to Zion. I've not been here before. So, but my sister is member of Zion already, is in Spain. So yesterday, I left home. I've already reached market that yesterday, where my sister sent me the link of the open heaven. So she pointed the place that daddy mentioned my case there. So when I listened to the, to the record, it was exactly what I'm passing through. Everything he said there is real. 
So I left the market immediately after listening to the, to the YouTube. I came down here throughout that yesterday to now. So let me just go straight to the, I'm the person that my, the person I took as my boss initiated me into a court, even without my concept. I don't, I don't even know that, the, that it's a secret court. That is a young boy. Your name is Obina. I will not say, I will not go direct. Obina, you were messed up. Somebody register your name in Satanic Award in our court. Obina, you become a member of Secret Court without knowing it. He gave you the clothes. He does you a clothes. He does you a clothes because you are very bright. He Marababa Shakata. He gave you a clothes and he wore the clothes. From the moment you wore the clothes, you started listening to what he's telling you. Obin, I don't know how to mention this. This is a man you respect so much. This is a man you see like Oka. This is a man you call my Oka. This is a man who called my yoga. This is a man who called still like God. This is a man who respects so much. There is nothing he can tell you that you will not do. Mari Baba Shanda, he don't know how to register you. He don't know how to beg you to belong where he belongs. Mari Baba Shakata, he gave you a clothes. Obina, he dat you a clothes. Obina, he dat you a clothes. Obina, he dat you a clothes and he wear the clothes. From the moment you wear the clothes, you already registered in our court world. You started losing your blessings. You are no longer bright the way you used to be. From there, whatever he tells you, you will not be more afraid. You are now a member of secret court. He has asked you to attend the meetings. That there is a meeting they belong, which you will say, say, I'm okay with it. You don't know that you are already satanically cage. Obina is a pity because you I know can never, you I know, with based on what I'm hearing now, can never like to join secret call. But they register you through clothes. And this is a man you respect. This is a man that have money. This is a man that have helped you. With what I'm saying, you will know yourself. Just I don't want to mention the name. This person called Obina. Tonight, let there be confusion between you and that man. Amen. Every gang up against you is here by council. The God will bring you out of that court. Amen. Because you're already a member, you're already a member, you're already a member. And since that time, you are now beginning to obey whatever they tell you to do. Oh, dinner, this is not your will, but you don't know how to come out. Run to Zion ministry. If you are too afraid, play this prophecy. Pray this prophecy. Play it to the moderators. Let them bring it to me. Mary Basha. Obi, you are not comfortable as a member of Secret Court. But you don't know how to come out. Your guy register you. You call that man my Mayoka. He call it my Mayoka. This is the only thing I will mention now. Jam your hands for the Holy Spirit of God. The battle will fight is spirit and not physical. Obina, Mari Basha. But today, let the fire of God separate you. Because to the Bible says in Hebrew 9, Hebrew 12, 29, that this God is a consuming fire. Deuteronomy 4, 24. This God is a devouring fire. It's not chapter 3. Fire was burning, but grasses were not born. The miracle system, let the fire on the altar never go down. Mari Basha. Zechariah 2, 5, I will encircle you with one of fire. Obi, I set you free from our courtesy. Amen. And let there be divine intervention Amen. that you will come out and come and meet all the Zion ministry. Amen. Be set free in the Holy Ghost. Fire. 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 The Holy Ghost. Fire. Praise the Lord. So let me go, let me go straight to the point, the way he took me there. Somebody, <coughs> there is a person I was doing business. Biko, don't call somebody's name. Give you. Okay, we, the prophecy did not mention somebody, right? All right. So don't call anybody's name. Just say things. Okay, okay sir. There is somebody I was doing business with at Ikeja. So there was a time the man is owing me a big amount of money. So I went to his office to discuss how he can pay me that money. So the man now, there is some things he did. He had the security to walk me out. So I left. I was not happy that day. So I now go back to this, my boss now, and I explain everything to him. In answer, I should take him to the man, I should take him to the man's office 
at the Keja, which I did. So when we go to the office, he said I should stay outside. Him, he entered. I don't know what he discussed with the man. So he came outside. He didn't tell me that this money, I cannot be able to collect this money or that this man don't want to pay this money. And that the man belongs to Oboni Court. That is how he told me. He didn't say I should come, let's go. That that is where he will take me now. That after like two days, the man will call me on phone. I should not come to that man again. That is the man that will be calling me to pay my money. I say, okay. So when I move, that he now took me to one place at the solo. That place is just a mansion. So when we entered there, I started seeing something like the key chicken here, the blood of other sacrifice things. So I now stay outside. Him, he now entered the building. So after like 10 minutes, he came, he came outside with razor blade and one small plastic native something. So he now caught my hand and used the thing to take my blood. So at that point, I don't know, I've not even understand anything that is happening because everything was so fast. So he now took down my blood and entered. After like five minutes, he said I should come inside. I enter. I still saw that blood inside that, inside the plate he put it. He now used the blood and put inside something like a um, pot. Water is inside the pot. So he now used, then I used small cup small cup to carry the water in my blood and give me and then drink it with uh, cola nuts. Them too, everybody that is inside there, they don't take the blood like that round. So they don't tell me that whatever that happened here must not be heard anywhere except I will die. So and I leave the, that is how we ended it for that day. And I left there. I did not even even that day too, I did not even understand myself. But the only thing I know that my spirit is telling me that I've gotten myself into mess. So, but I did not talk to that my boss. So after like two days, he, he see that I'm not coming close to him again. He didn't call me that I should come and help him to buy food in the market. And then came. Normally, I used to do the message for him. He then brought out one white polo. He said that he bought this shirt now that is bigger than the shirt. I should take it and wear. And I said, okay. And I removed my, the shirt I came to market with. And I wear that one. So the, the, the clothes was now okay on my body. He and said I, he gave you a clothes. Yes, sir. He gave me one shirt, white. So, and I wear the shirt. I decided to dash that one I came to market out. And I give to somebody. And I, that is his own that I now put on throughout that day. So later, I was not wearing the, the, the clothes. I not, I call, and I even like the clothes. I started putting it every time, every time. Putting it on every time, every time. It was one day that my wife now said that, is it only this clothes I have? Okay. Is it only this clothes I have that every time I'll be putting on this white? What is special about this white? That was when I now stopped uh, wearing the white. So on that process, I stopped wearing the white. I can't find it. After some weeks, I can't find that white again. I've been looking for the clothes. Even up to now, I've not seen it. I don't know how the clothes got disappeared. So since then, I've been looking for solution. Even since after the, I started looking for that white, that is how my business, since we, from that day, the thing disappeared. That is how my business started collapsing from one problem to the other, from one problem to the other. And the thing is, with, once I do big business, somebody send me like one million or two million and one problem, immediately the money will go through that problem. So I will make millions, I can't use it to do anything. It's problem from problem, problem from problem. Even this first of February this year, this month now, I still have a big problem that I just finished sorting out, and that one still cost me a lot of, somebody sent me one million naira that day, my customer. I had another problem again that day, I spent seven, 700 plus. So this thing keep on happening, and I keep on looking for solution everywhere. I've gone to even the place I'm not supposed to go. So at a point, I decided to call my family this month, 
I now tell my family, look at what is going on. I that, that can't keep this thing. My mom, everybody is aware of it now. Everybody. So I now tell them, this is how it is. So if there are any person that have a solution, let's, I'm, I'm, I'm ready to come out of it. So it was not that yesterday, yesterday morning that my sister sent me this link. And I'm listening to it was exactly everything. And I said, no, that even the market that I am, I'm not seeing anything there. That it's better I leave this market and come to this place. So that is how I left the market and come down here yesterday. So, but I couldn't give my testimony. I said that today I will still continue. And also, I've decided to be a member of Zion from now on. Is that all you can do for this mighty God of prophecy with instant solution? First, yeah, people, let you host men. Are you? Our brother here is testifying of how the mighty God of Zion ministry located him and provides solution for a problem that he has been into for a very long time. That inside the market where he does his business, there is a particular man that usually helps him by giving him some goods, some credit. So he took the man to be a boss to him and also run some errands for the man. He's a man he respects so much. So at a time, he went to the man for a solution that someone is owing him money. So the man told him to take him to the place of the person that is owing him. On getting there, the man left him outside and went in after discussing with the person that was owing him, came out and told him that him alone cannot get the money from that man, that he have to take him somewhere where they will fortify him so that in two days' time, he will have his money. He agreed to that because he was in desperate need of the money. On getting to the place, the man took him. He, he, they cut his finger with a razor blade, took some part of his blood into their temple while he was still outside. The man later came and brought him into the chamber where every other person were. As he entered there, he noticed that it was a fetish place, which is believed to be an occultic temple. He saw that blood that they took from him. In his presence, they dipped the blood into a bowl that contains some water, which he doesn't know the substance. They mixed his blood with that uh, liquid content, and he drank some of it. And every other member of the secret cult in that room drank the blood. Then the next day, the man called him inside the market and dashed him a white T-shirt, told him to be wearing the T-shirt every day. And he continued to wear the T-shirt at the instruction of the man, only for him to come back one day. The wife challenged him that he mustn't be wearing this shirt every day, or is there anything about the clothes that she doesn't know? At that day, he decided to drop the clothes, and that was the, the day that the clothes disappeared. He couldn't find the clothes anymore. And from that, uh, that very day, his business began to crumble. Everything about him began to shatter. Problems everywhere. Each time any money enters his hand, a problem will come immediately and sweep the money away. Even the one that the man was owing him, he was not able to recover. And that was how he has been sold down until the day our daddy in the Lord mentioned his case during the night of open heaven and ended it with him coming to see daddy so that he can provide solution to his problem. That and is that why God has brought this op open heaven for people to be liberated. I don't know whether you are seeing something here. Kora Chinekaka. Now, where is your wife? Where is the wife? My wife traveled. She traveled to the east. We would like to see your wife. Okay. How do you get to know the prophecy? Because you're not, as you said, you're not a Zion member. So how do you get to know? My sister is in Spain. She is a member here before she traveled. So she used to follow up online. So your sister is Spain? Yes. She was the one that, that told you. Did yes. you tell your sister that you are, you, they registered you in our court? 
Yes, sir. I told this month I call everybody. I told them, both my mom, both my when I cannot. You told your mom and everybody. Yes, all my family. I told them. Which state do you come from? Anambra State. Okay. And when you when does I have? Which local government? Okanot, sir. Eh? Okanot, sir. Okanot. Yes, sir. Okay. Yes. Do you know Zayo have followers outside more than Nigeria? The other man said, my sister in uh, London. This one, my sister in Spain. Now, nah, God will bless you. Do we call anybody's name now? Nah? So anybody making trouble is making on his own. We didn't mention anybody's name. Nah, so bad. God bless you. We're going to pray for you. When your wife come, the prayer, the prayer I want to do, because she boy, you must bring this boy. Now nah, he has come out and they may be looking for him to kill him. Hey, Adam, bring him so that I will pray for him and his wife. But they be singing all the time. Everybody. 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 Ajo lam yao Ajo lam yao Ajo lam yao If anybody is telling you to join secret court, don't listen to these people. They have destroyed a lot of souls. So many ogres today are into secret court. And these people go to church on Sunday. These people receive communion. They are even the first that receive communion. There is no church you will go without seeing members of secret courts. Because most of the men of God does not hammer the preaching. And most of the time, they are the ones supporting the church more. So you can't say anything that can provoke them. But where are we heading to? What shall it profit a man after you gain the whole world and lose your soul? Now, today, I put you into the new covenant of Luke 22 20. This is the blood of my new and everlasting covenant. It's a Kerenan 11. I set the prisoners free because of the blood of my covenant. Revelation 12 11. We overcame Satan by the blood of the Lamb and by the words of our testimony. Exodus 12 13. For when I see the blood, I will pass over. For Revelation 1 5, you are purchased with this blood. On this blood, I put your destiny today Amen. for restoration. Amen. Amen. Yes, sir. Court. And from today, May your business turn around Amen. for your good. Amen. Any of them that will come to make you mad, to disgrace you, may that madness go to that person. Amen. <sighs> your case is settled. Amen. In Jesus' holy name. Amen. Jam your hands for the Holy Ghost.
Obinak, Obinak are you? In the Abuka, the same case. Mano of Foya Kedri is here. In the Abuka of it's not hanging up again. Obinak, wait. Oba Obina. Ngewaga. Oba Oba Obina. Mano Chaya Kedri is here in a court. As I've a mother, 13 years. Go on, go on. Don't call somebody's name. Okay. You remember, there was a day he called me, he said he's from outside country. He brought two clothes for me. So after I wear that two clothes, I noticed that all my, I start having problems. All my business, everything vanish. Okay. Bring all of them with the other one that testify. Uh, prophecy for one is for is prophecy for oh. all. Han Chalina Ebu in the same case of occultism. Are you ready to give your life to Jesus? Huh? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. May the Lord show you mercy. Jen on all time to issue. Then I'll be after this program. Touch your head on that, Lord. Ozone layer of first quarter. Okay, one is with the clothes. Aha, cha how were they, Baba? Nabia, gaba 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 gaba. Call the officer. Ozone layer, doctor say alano. The level of sun, no no no, but the weather carries it. My name is Kumbadewe Emanuela. I'm from Benue State. I come here January 2024. When I care, Daddy was touching people. I say ah. Daddy come past me. I say ah. This guy issue. Daddy go locate me so. Then I call here like three times. I say ah. I no see that I no go come again. Then I go sit down. Two day, two weeks back, I did not call. So on the twenty-first of February, Daddy mentioned my case. Night of. That is a sister. Your name is Ella. You are from Benue State. Your name is Ella. You are from Benue. Benue. And the Spirit is not telling me if you are watching at this hour. So I don't know if you are watching now. Or you will watch it. Young lady, your tears will turn to joy. Amen. You are not favored when it comes to issue of marriage. You have been abandoned and the children abandoned by husbands. And the person that married you that you trusted so much abandoned you with the children. The second one you enter into also have the same problem. This person called Ella, you must come down to Zion Ministry. It's not just only online. Your yoke is broken, but yes, I want to see you in Zion. If you find it difficult to see me play this prophecy to the moderators. Your name is Ella. 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 This is second man. And two of them have left you with the children. You born for the first one and you born for the second one. And two of them right now, none of them is in your life again. The first one, you have children. You have a child. You are not with that one. The second one, you are not with. You are confused. And this is not what you projected for yourself. Your name is Ella from the New Estate. May the mercy of God come upon you Amen. that even this night that your yoke is broken. Amen. I see the Lord will be defying you. Amen. That this person called Ella, you will give testimony and you will praise the God of Ofuchara Fancha, the God of Omechara Fancha, and the God of Okuchara Fancha. Your case is set to young lady in the name of J E S U S. From there. 
I promised myself that I will not leave this church here. I will die in this ministry. I promised myself that I will not leave this ministry here. I will die. Hey, well, no more. Why did he say you will not come? Come. I'm drunk, I just don't want to be known. Come. But there, come on and come on out of Give that person a high ten. Oh, I need a man, I won't even chuck. A man and a dog, a dog, a man, I won't even chuck. And I'm a two year dog. A man, I won't even chuck. Get on team. Wait, wait, hey man, wait. Doliti Elu. You say you are from Benue. I look into my eyes, Daddy. Oh. Daddy, you are too much. Daddy, I can't sleep. Immediately you measure my case, I did not sleep in the night. Huh? I did not sleep the day you measured my kids. He did not sleep. Yes, Daddy. <laughs> People I said sleep never catch you. Hey, Amen. No. You don't bomb for two men. Huh? You don't bump for two men. Talk <laughs> now. Yes, daddy. Did you discuss your problem to the man of God? No, no, no. Have I seen you before? No, daddy, no, 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 no. This is what they call no. prophecy with the instant solution. Use their village language and call him beautiful names. Ndana Soibo is English your village language. Abara gare ne maji hege me kosara ya. Abara gare kosara Jesus sonye me. So now, where are your children? The one you have for the first man, the one you have for the second man. Where are they? Daddy, I don't know where the father or the father. You don't know. <laughs> are they with their father? No, no, only one. Where is the father? With me. Only, father. only one is with you. Okay. What are you doing now? Daddy, I have a job I'm managing Kaja for this balance. Okay. Christian will bring you so that we can discuss how to bring your children to you and how to make sure you are living comfortably. Yes, Amen. <laughs> are you hearing me? Yes, Daddy. They will bring you one on one to me. Oh? Yes, Daddy. Benue girl. What type of Benue? Is he a dumb man? He get a thief. 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 Yes, sir. Oh, no, 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 May the Lord bless you and protect you. Amen. In Jesus' holy name. Amen. So, Christian will bring you. Let me know the word about your children. Sir. It's not what we're going to do here. Let's know the word about all your children. This is prophecy. Ella, Benue. You have children for this man. This is what they call prophecy. Prophecy is not that here I see. Oh, Mona, Who wants to receive short gift with me? Where are those who desire such gifts? Everything you see, I've never slept with anybody's wife before. The problem is just the talent, the gift. My problem today is just the gift, no other thing. I've never taken what belongs to somebody. 
I want why I'm doing on here. I want why I'm not a little bit. Even as so cool with the gift of the Holy Spirit. Ella, God bless you. She said it's only one child out of the children. I would have. Christian will bring you, don't worry. Just wipe your tears. Your life will change. Your case is settled. Amen. God, jam your hands for the Holy Ghost. I don't see a lick and lick. I don't see a lick and lick. Who changed you? Who gave me? I don't see a lick and lick. Who changed you? Ozi <laughs> Let them play the prophets in Ozi. Uh -huh. Come here. Not this one, oh. Look at my Agabala Mozama. Ozi Chineke. Agabala Mozama. Ozi Nam Ziri Mo. Agabala Mozama. Ozi Chineke. Onye Jure Sam. Why Agabala Mozama. I'm a soldier. 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 I'm a there is a celebration in heaven over one repented. And you watch, and you watch in the blood, in the soul of the land. Oh, 
Man, we are two of you. Die. I go come here, man, on Wednesday. Who are you people staying with? Prophecy I with see you. people in a public place. I see two of you. We are boys and girls. Enter. I see two of you. We are people that are smoking are entering. Two of you are too small for this. How old are you? Huh? How old are you? How many times have two of you come to Zion? Huh? My first time. How many times? First time. Have I talked to two of you before? No. Which state did two of you come from? Please. Who brought you, people? Who brought you? Hey. Are you ready to give your life to Christ? Will you, is it possible? Yes. Huh? Yes. 
e de sho yes rose dia e ya no lobu kid see for man of god na you are too small for this are you not too small huh yes why where is your parents do they know what you are doing huh no ho oh. Do you still want to go to school? Eh? Yes. Can you stop and I will help you? Eh? Yes. Can you stop and I will help you? Yes. Why are you lecturing this one? Mm, this one I will let senior. Ne, will you stop too? Eh? Yes. Eh? You want to go to school? Huh? Yeah. Can you stop? Then I will help you to go to school. Yeah. You promise? Yes. Have I talked to any of you before? No. Huh? No. What I'm telling you to stop. Hope you know what I'm saying. Huh? Yes. Or should I say it publicly? Huh? No. Nakaguraku no too small for this. No the too small for this. Wagano towards the altar. I'm going to assist you people. Are you hearing me? Do you know any of these girls? Do you know any of them? Come. Huh? Yes, sir. You know this one. You want to quit job quick. No, two of you go to the around the <coughs> happy, happy, I can come out of her. No, no. Holy Ghost, 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 let her go. J E S U S T. Come here, small, small guests. Are living the life they're not supposed to live. Come on. But they fire. Born, 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 born. Let her go. But they are so. But they are saying they cannot. But they are saying they cannot. No, no. But they are. Help her. Leave two of them. Car. Let them go. Let them go. Fire. Let them go. Fire. Let them go. Fire. 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 Born. Born. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. The Holy Ghost. For this reason, the Son of Man was made a manifest. Bring them a few. To destroy the works of enemy. Fast. Our work here is to destroy the works of enemy. Fast. Let two of them hug themselves. Now, J E S U S. Papa, come out of there. Come out. Loose. Power. Marine. Marine. Come out. Come out. Come out. Let her go. 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 
go. The weird rosary, thinking to deceive me. I am a prophet from the womb. In an amam, lose your Come out of her. Holy Ghost, 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 Holy Bring the other one. As I'm setting them free in the name of Jesus, let the whole boys that have entered also be set free. Amen. Amen. Who are you? Of her. Let her go. The covenant is broken. It's broken. It's broken. It's broken. Now, J E S U S T S O. Break. Level 14 14. 14 14. This one, 999. Your yoke is broken. Amen. Now, J E S U S. Jesus. Break every chain. 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 I have to adopt these girls. Let them get here and ask who might say Alalani. Because it's not even their fault. They were initiated to be doing this. And they have come far. These are small, small girls. Jesus Lord, I am for mercy. Let me know He belongs in the all my sins. I now need that I will I see the day. We have agreement today. To send the baby to school, right? You say you want to go do for Catherine, yeah. and you will not do what you are doing again. Huh? Yeah. You say you want to, what do you want to do? I want to go to school. You want to go to school? Yes. I will send two of you to school on agreement that nobody, you will not do it again. Huh? Yes. You will get your bags out.
Oh yeah, help me to remove the rings on the nose. Your taste, go close to the altar and stay and wait for me. One of the only simple states. Why, what I say on the young gentleman server? Amen. And they have gone to a good state to bring their bags. Their journey started today. Kora Chine Kaka. Seraphic found that you want Ungongwa, Eje Tinabu Mount. And it's not just this, so God is faithful, though. They came with their two friends today again. Four, four. Let those four come. We are going to help all of them. Piano. We are going to help them. Onya, Hona, Popotea. E Bobble, Hana, Popotea. The four, the four friends. Nalo Falwa. Ebuko be five. Yes. Somebody that wants to kill me. If you kill me, will you be able to do the work I'm doing? How are you? I'm fine, sir. Which state do you come from? I'm from Ebony State. Oh, sir. Hey boy, where do you come from? Imo State. Imo State. Imo Kema. Hey man, eh, mo wan wan e kuru. Ne, which state? Cross River. Eh? Cross River. Oh, you have it, man, and the bone. Eh? Do you get anyone? God bless you, Cross River. You, where do you come from? Inugu State. Uh, okay, let me. The boy, the boy, what are you here? You, you know the woman, where did they sleep? Huh? Yeah, Mike. No, I don't do what they do. Like, you I'm come with them? Yeah, yeah. Why did you come with them? Okay, just come for the prayer. Yeah, this is my second time. Huh? This is my second time coming. This to is my cannot stand off for me. I don't know why. I'm struggling to hear. He said, This is your second time. I came last week Sunday. You know them? Yeah. Where do you know them? Um, it's been long. So you are the one servicing the no, machine? No, 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 Okay. Okay, there's something we want to do now. Do you people saw their deliverance? Huh? Yes, yes. So what makes you to feel to come? Because I didn't know you people. It was the deliverance. The deliverance? Yes. You, Uncle? She invited us. She invited you. You know, I brought them out now. So I'm going to establish them. No more the work of what they are doing. So, I'm going to make sure they are okay. Are you, you just come for prayer or you want to follow the way I want, look at them, they have brought their back. So, what is your own mind? Because it, salvation is not by force. Having a new life is not by force. That day when I pray for them, I ask them, are you ready to change? They say yes. But since that time, I pay money, they have been sleeping in lodge. In the lodge. Hostel, sorry, hostel. So, to show that they really want to change. In fact, they are the one that went to a good state. To bring their bag. So, that is, that is what we do here. And uh, two of them, I will make sure their future is bright. They marry a good husband. I will make sure because they have shown the sign of coming back to Christ. So, you people, did you just come for prayer? Or you feel like 
following their footstep of coming back to Jesus, abandoning those two, two thousand, three, three thousand. Yes. Like how much they used to pay there? I don't know. Ten. How much? Ten. Ten thousand. Mm. So somebody with five thousand will not come. So, what do people want? I want to, I want to follow them. You want to follow them? That means you go and bring your bag. We will see you on Sunday if you want to follow them. This one, Sunko? I need prayer. Huh? Prayer. Prayer. You don't want I to do return the way they have returned. I do. Uh, on Sunday, you, Uncle? I want prayers and I also want to be the same way they are. You want to be the same way. God bless all of you. Okay. So, Christian, if people will carry this bag, you carry the bag. No, I'm not Two of you, go and sit down. After the program, we will find a place where people will stay. The new work and the, the new job and the school. And was, out of 12, there must be some people that come prayer here and not prayer they come. They will begin to follow you now. You may end up doing what. You, came, you run away from doing it here. Some people that come here are not come here for prayer. Even if that person is wearing uniform, security, or some brother, or cannot man, or member, or under the or under workers, or Justin. Don't look at them. Are you hearing me? I'm going to to know you. I'm going to know you. Another set. That a married man, when they are giving their life, I prostitute. You know, hey, you that are not a virgin, you are not married. What are you? A girl who is not a virgin and she's not married, who are you? Says, he says. Okay, men and Sunday, go up again. Let's watch. Who are you living with? Huh? Come here. Look at my eyes. Do you know me? Yes, I know you. What is my name? How long have you been coming to Zion? This June. The Spirit of God is telling me that you are living with a man. Yes. How old are you? Who are you living with? Huh? Come here. 
Look at my eyes. Do you know me? Yes, I know you. What is my name? How long have you been coming to Zion? Since June. The Spirit of God is telling me that you are living with a man. Yes. How old are you? Huh? Has he married you? No. So why are you staying with a man that have not married you? Huh? Nothing. Which state do you come from? Huh? No state. Where are your parents? Huh? My mother is late. What of your father? He's in the east. How many siblings do you have? Seven. Seven. How many boys? How many girls? Three boys and four girls. Those three boys and uh, four girls, where are they? I huh? I don't. Talk now. I don't know. You don't know your sisters and brothers, their whereabouts? I know of my sister, but I don't know of my brothers. So where are your sister? Huh? Two are married. What of the other two? It's me and my younger sister. You and your younger sister. Where are they? Those that are married and your younger sister, where are they? They are in the Imo state. And my younger sister is in Lagos. You and your younger sister is here? In Lagos. How long do you know that man you are staying with? For a year. Where do you meet him? Where I work. Where do you work? I work in a bar. Bar. In which area? Huh? Lagos Island. So, that boy. You are staying with. Is he here? Is, is he here? If the man is here, let him come. How are you? Yes, yeah, sir. Which state do you come from? Anambra. Anambra. Mbenda nambra ji mema yi ha bota. When why why is she staying with you? Not as well. Huh? Mm, because you don't have any place where to live in. I can't hear you. Because you want to be old body. There is no where she's living. Yeah, we also in a place so far. You allow a girl to be staying with you? Huh? Yes, sir. Why didn't you allow other boys that are homeless to stay with you? You're a very kind man. Very kind. Oh, you'll be a better. Are you not aware that having sex is no good? Huh? I know, sir. Have you heard me preaching about it? So why are you keeping a woman in your house? Are you married to her? Huh? No, sir. Have you paid her bride price? Keeping her wholesale because you want to help her. It's not good. If God is demanding something from us to help us, we cannot be alive now. Now you that are a girl, will it be single? <sighs> so, are you not aware that what you are doing with her is not good? Eh? I know. Jesus, na pare, na beno. Two of you, Reverend. Everything have a season. Maybe this is reason 
the Lord who made me to go. Ne. Are you not aware that staying with a man is not good? Eh? You want to continue? So what do you want me to do for you? Now, nah, do you want to marry her? Be honest. Be honest. Don't lie. Whatever you say here, can say. do you want to marry this girl? Eh? No, sir. You don't want to marry her? No, but I can hear you Now, in our dory, only gray yarn. Okay, do it for you, only. It do it for me. He said you are selling where? Well, it. I will leave you. Well, it is you where? Look, bring your face. You are working where? I've changed my. I've changed my place of work. Where are you working now? How much are they paying you? What? What do you want to do? Huh? I want to rent a house and start my own business. If you rent a house and you stay alone, you will turn that place to a hotel. A single girl is not supposed to stay alone. Your younger sister, that is that one in Lagos. Who is she staying with? Be honest to me. Another boy. Who? Huh? With her girlfriend. Abia. Girlfriend. Is she here? Nah. Here, you will go and bring your sister. So that. We will check where two of you can be staying or who you can be staying with, with your sister. Then you start a business. Are you hearing me? Yes, sir. You will go and call your sister to come on uh, when? Even if today I will call her. You can call her today. So... No, today is already late, right? You can bring her on Wednesday, two of you. Huh? Okay. Let's look for a place two of you will be living and what two of you are supposed to be doing so that your mom, wherever she is, her spirit will be happy. Staying with a boy, like a husband and wife, when you are not married, it's not good. Oh, I will help you to get a place you will stay. No. Nah. Have I talked to two of you before? Huh? No. If you lie, you die. Me na go loku before. Huh? Mba. The spirit directed me to you to rescue you. Because what you are doing is no good. Because when you are living with a man, you will be, he have access to you whenever he like. When you end up married, he is here in River Niger. No. Nah. God bless you. Next time, don't live with a girl. It will be bringing bad luck. Because of twin or now, you will be having sex. Huh? Yes, sir. You can't go far by every time sex. I don't know why. The preaching I'm giving here every day is like some people don't understand it. Do you think this is discipline? You can't be living with a girl when you are not married. It is a huge distraction. Some favor will not be coming. If we get this you are living like a married man. When you are not married, when you are not married, you keep going. Man, who do I you? I see we can reach on, we can reach on. No, no, to them go to robot. A man, a man living with a woman every day, and I have people like husband. Get your man who die every week. I will go to the machine, machine on every week. 
Abu Gadi Mechin, or Koiji. Abu Ikana Abu Mechin. Most of men now, Kwagidiko, when they're not married, strength is no longer there. How can a man be living with a woman you have not married day and night, two of you? Ah, ah. Tomorrow now, if you marry, you will begin to blame your wife because the things you're supposed to use to produce a healthy children, in our buffet, or is the day of enter house pot, those that are giving birth with a raw spam, but also nemotua, kengali nemotua, that the actual men go akamu. Because the, 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 the strength is no more there. All these men, also know about Kwamiko, you must preserve what you will use to produce a healthy children. That is why sometimes doctors ask you, don't sleep with a woman for the sperm to be rich. No. If you can bring your sister, your sister, you, two of you, we find a way to bring your bag. Let's look for a place. Two of you will stay with somebody and start something so that you marry. You want to marry, right? Huh? Yes. As you are staying with him now, he doesn't want to marry you. And the two of you are together. If a man wants to marry you now, the man will withdraw back because he will think that two of you are married. So you are hurting yourself. Are you hearing me? On Wednesday, bring your sister. Bring your bag. Let's look for a place you can stay. It will help you. Yes, sir. Thank you. Nah. God bless you. You're a Zion member. Eh? For Yes, sir. For, yes, sir. For how long? Yeah, you might make me to come over. Eh? You might make me to start coming over. She makes you to start coming. Yeah. Uh, since you are becoming, are you not hearing my teaching? Yeah, I hear you, sir. I don't know you are. Oh, I don't know you are. I Stay away from sex. May the Lord prosper your business in the name of Jesus. Amen. What a question job with all evil. Now try it. Sister, you don't tell you work. Jenna. Huh? Each other, I'm going to know why. Ew. 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 You're supposed to be an empath. Is it you? It doesn't. Stay away from sex. So that you can prosper. May the Lord bless you. Give somebody a high turn. Don't sleep with her again. Give her her bags to come out. Are you hearing me? Jam your hand for the Holy Spirit. Be an Okay, after the program, we're going to see all your siblings. Nina Batarabatsa, we want to see all of them. What do you want to do? I want to go to school. You want to go to school? Nursing school. Nursing school. You are the younger sister? Yes. Two of you are living in different places? Yes. Now, I want a place that two of you can be staying together. Okay. You want to you like a part of your time? Yes, sir. Don't worry. Jenna, you're not going to be able to do it. 
Sineke, here to be a gun of Wabri, but never. Can cover herself for what I can do. Will you shot fire? happy, happy, let her go, let her go, let her go, let her go, let her go. Holy Ghost, 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 Holy Ghost. Listen, if you are the type that normally say you are close to Brother Ebukaobi, you take picture from me and use it to be scamming people, you are going to place a curse upon you. Whether you are a worker or not worker, people take pictures with me everywhere, airport, anywhere. Yesterday, some of you, we, we saw how a security man in my office was collecting money from somebody to give him access to see a booker. Some of you name is in the yak and the security or worker. If you are gonna want a girl over there, but you're a chukubia, Guinea and I then I'm my son and Guinea, brother Buka, five and six. Anytime you want to see brother Buka, I will give you space. And because of that, you use my name now to wine. You will bring a curse upon yourself. This is Zion Ministry. This ministry stands for safe, saving of. Sister, that carry her bag. Where are you going? Are you going? Come back. Where are you going? Come with the boy. Huh? I was going home, sir. You're going home? How many times have you come to a program here? When the program has not started, you want to go home. Why do you want to go home? Where is the, uh, who, who are you staying with? Madam, who are you staying with? You are staying with somebody. Huh? Sister, have I talked to you before? Never. You don't supposed to be living with a man that wants to marry you. God is blessing you. You are seeing money. You are seeing money. The Spirit of God is telling me to call you that you are following on the wrong direction. You can't have a man in your house. A man is the one that's supposed to help all you. And that is after marriage. Have I talked to you before? No, sir. What am I telling her? Is it true? Eh? Yes, sir.
Yeba. Ebenezer. 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 My soul of hell, only you are my helper. You receive a call that makes you thinking of going back. Who is the person calling you? Huh? You must be careful. This is your mom. Eh? Yes, sir. You have made a mistake so much with his father. Another mistake. Am I speaking to somebody? Eh? You're very right. Eh? You're very right. Don't make another mistake. Don't keep a man in your house. God is blessing you with money. Manage your money. Let him be on him. If he doesn't have a house, you are not the one to harbor him. Madam, whether because of you he relocated to Lagos is not an uh, excuse. You don't live with a man until he married you. And he's not even in your house. Be careful. And maybe God wants you to tell you something. Now, do you want your mom to make another mistake? Huh? No, sir. Are you surprised? Yes, sir. What makes you to be surprised? Because what you're saying is true. Wow. Akini komeri ronuwa Eja tu ya kiri 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 no Opusi na mumba ngone bu otuku nye ya Ya ne buru yoku Go back to the prayer after the prayer Christian will bring you I will talk to you Na stay you you have a bright fisher You have a bright future. You will not die. You're bright. You're bright. God bless you. And I love you. Your mother will have entered into another wahala. God bless you. Yeah, what can I better you deny? You ask yourself, is it my money he wants to marry or me? May God bless you. Amen. I was on the altar. I saw them going, going, going. The Lord said, the voice said, call them back. May the Lord bless you. Amen. Oh. But you have to come back and see me one on one. Let me direct you. God bless you. Give somebody a high ten. Tap that person beside you. Tell that person, this law concerning your family must be broken today. This, this law concerning your family must, must be broken today. That law in your family. That law in your family. Stand up and give ten people a hot crack and communicate it to that ten people. The law in your family must be broken. 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 May your mother twenty. The law in your family must be broken. The law in your family must be broken. Mother thirty. That's law. That's law. 
in your family, in your family, must be lifted, must be lifted, must be lifted, must be lifted, must be broken, must be broken. But you can now for money and achievement. Did I can look up, but it's here you can. Did I can look up, yeah, No, to them, book right, a lobo, all the ego. Namoyalo sit down like a king. Open the book of Esther, chapter four, verse sixteen. Esther 4, 16. Go and get all the Jews in Susa together. Go and get all the Jews in Susa together. Hold a fast and pray for me. Hold a fast and pray for me. Don't eat or drink anything for three days and nights. Hope you are watching your television. Yes. Repeat that one again. Don't eat or drink anything for three days and nights. Don't eat or drink anything for three days and nights. That is three days dry. No food, no water for three days and, th and three nights. Uh -huh. My servant women and I will be doing the same. I will not be left alone. My servant and I will be doing the same. After that, I will go to the king. After that, Esther said, after this fasting, I will go to the king. Even though it is against the law. Even though going to the king is against the law. If I must die for doing it, I if, will die. If I must die by going to the king, let me die. die. Esther said, the law does not permit me. My candidate I say, I'm a boy, Jesus. And Jesus, your mother will not be there. Your mind will be towards the prophecy and solution. You will not pay attention to the word of God. We don't used to know when he preached. You see that? Esther said, by law, I don't suppose to go to the king. The Israelites were persecuted in a foreign land. A man who called Haman has made a plan to kill Mordecai and to kill all the Jewish people. Mordecai got that information. Mordecai sent a message to Esther. Don't allow this terrible thing to happen. Go to king and beg the king on our behalf. Tell the king that his senior officer called Haman is planning to tell the king the plan of Haman to kill all of us. Esther replied to Mordecai. He said, you know that king have a lot of wives. By law, no woman have the right to go to king except he summon you. The law said that anybody that go to king without king demanding for that person must be killed. When Esther replied Mordecai, Mordecai sent another message to Esther. He said, Esther, be very careful. Maybe it is because of a time like this that God planted you in Asorok. Maybe it is a time like this that God made you to be a queen. Go to king and beg for Jewish people's life. But let me tell you, if you refuse to do it, help will come from somewhere. But your father's name will be forgotten. 
when Esther received this message, he, he replied Mordecai by telling him, go and tell the whole people of Israel to fast. We are going to fast three days and three nights. It is very, very unfortunate in our time that many of us don't have the strength of fasting anymore. We listen to men of God and some witchcraft and some people who are satanic that will tell you, why are you fasting? Osa, 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 osa. My brother and sister, if Osa can kill somebody, Osa will have killed me. And there cannot be nobody, any man of God trying to condemn fasting or a woman of God trying to condemn fasting. The person is doing it out of he or her own weakness. Before the ministry of Jesus started, he fasted 40 days and 40 nights. He could not start his ministry without the fasting. Before Moses could get the Ten Commandments, he fasted for 40 days and 40 nights. Twice. John the Baptist, 21 days. In our own time, they will tell you it's not a matter of fasting. It is a matter of fasting. Before Esther went to the king, he sent a message to Mordecai. He said to him, go and tell the whole Jewish people to fast with me. All of us, we fast three days dry fasting. No food, no water. After this fasting, I am going to go to king. I'm going to tell the king that a man called Haman, look at the plan he have on the ground to wipe us away. I will not go to king except we finish this fasting. The whole Jewish people, nobody could eat or drink for three days. Three days dry. Today, somebody will tell you, a fasting, a fasting. 100 days is about to start. We benefit more from 100 days. This year on, we start, I think, in the next two months. May. I think May is when it normally starts. From May to August, three days, 100 days. When the Lord sent Jordan, Jonah to go and tell the people of Nineveh that the Nelivan will be destroyed. Forty days from now, Jonah was trying to hide, but eventually Jonah went to the Nineveh. Fish swallowed and vomited him there. What happened? Jonah said to the people of Nineveh, Forty days from now, God is going to destroy your country. What happened? The king of Nineveh declared three days fasting and prayer. Even the rats in Nineveh, even the goats, dog, slave, everybody fasted three days and three nights. King he put off a sackcloth cloth. He removed his gold as a king and put on a rag on his body. And the Bible says after that three days fasting and prayer, no food, no water. The Bible says, God said to Jonah, go back and tell the king of Nineveh, I have showed them mercy. I will no longer destroy them. There is power in prayer and fasting. Touch your neighbor, tell that person, there is power in fasting and prayer. There is power in fasting and prayer. Am I communicating? Yes, sir. Am I speaking to somebody? Yes, sir. Esther wanted to go to king because spiritual control the physical. Esther, he understand the implication of just walking to the king when the king did not summon you. Esther, first of all, shame the spirit of king because you can bind somebody's spirit. Proverbs 21 verse 1, the heart of a king is in the hands of God. So you can use prayer to change the mind of the king before you go to him. The same way the evil people bind somebody, you can use prayer to bind somebody. Esther fasted three days. The Bible says she did not eat or drink for three days because she was about to do something that is contrary, that is against the law. 
She said, I will go to king. Going to king without him summoning me is against the law. But I will go. And the Bible says, after the fasting and prayer of Esther, she removed the dirty clothes and put on a gold clothes. She put on a fine clothes. She dressed very well. She was looking take away. Esther was looking take away. Even though she was weak physically, but her spirit is beautiful. Because spiritual control the physical. Even though her physical life, she was walking. She nearly fainted. She went to the king, contrary to the law. The law said, but let them make him. The Lord said that nobody can go to the king except the king. Someone her. King, he has so many wives. Esther wanted to go to king against the law. She needed to fast and use prayer to hold the mind of king. And the Bible says, after her fasting and prayer, she put on her gold clothes. The Bible said she was walking to the king. Another thing after this program, you will be a risk taker, positive risk taker. Because after this program, every satanic law working against your family will be shattered by fire. Amen. That's amen. So far, so quite Amen. That amen have HIVS. Amen. That amen have hepatitis B. Amen. Sit down like a king. Am I speaking to somebody here? I don't, sir. And the Bible said, Esther fasted. After the three days fasting and prayer, she went to the king. King saw Esther. The king is supposed to destroy Esther because it was the king that made the, that made the law. Anybody, any of my wife that must see me must be summoned by me. If she come without me summoning her, she must be killed. But after the fasting, Esther went to the king. She was weak because she has not eaten for three days and three nights. When the king saw her, the king was not seeing ordinary Esther. The king was seeing a woman enveloped with glory, with Shekinah, with favor, with anointing. King saw her and said, Queen Esther, king he started calling her Queen Esther. What do you want me to do for you? Even half of my kingdom, I will give you. Where are the Esther generation here? Wave your hands. Uh, the king saw Esther and said, Evil, tell me, King Queen Esther, even half of my kingdom. I will give you because Esther has caged the mind of the king with the fasting and prayer and the holiness. You must pray. You must fast. Ignore those telling you it's not all about fasting and prayer. No authentic man of God can really make impact without fasting and prayer. It's not every teaching you will listen, no matter who is preaching. If I begin to tell you now, because you love Brother Ebuka, because you cherish Brother Ebuka, because I know some of you love me crazily, and I come on Sunday night and begin to tell you, go and begin to sleep with any girl you see. Will you listen to that teaching? It's not everything you see on social media you will listen some people are just preaching in order to get comments. Hey, right on. Mommy, you are there. Daddy, right on. Egweji. Mbah. If you know Brother Ebuka, Brother Ebuka does not send. What others run away from speaking is what I speak. And God is bringing more people the more I speak. Am I speaking to somebody here? Am I communicating? Yes, sir. The king, he said to Esther, even half of my kingdom, I will 
give you. Do you know Esther went to the king contrary to the law? I don't know. This 20 days fasting and prayer is all about the law in your family. There are some people in their family, nobody gets married on time. That is a law that has been existing from years for years in your family. There are some people in their family that is a particular law that you must have breast cancer. There are some people in their family that is a law that is only one son you will have. Anytime you try to have a second son, you will die. There are laws in your family. There are some laws that people will first have money in the morning, but in the evening, they begin to go backward. Calling rising and falling. So many family here. Your senior brother started doing well, but now he's going backward. The second son pick up. He started doing well, but now he's no more to be found. That is a law in your family. In these 20 days, that law is going to shattered by fire. Amen. That law is going to be shattered by fire. Amen. Madoleji Mike in Well, you can no treat message is very important. You know, 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 Today, there are different kinds of law existing in so many family. There are some people in their own family is dead. Nobody lasts more than 70 years. Law in different family. We have come to revisit the law going on in your family. There are some family that are diabetic law. Everybody must have diabetes. Diabetes, diabetes. I don't know the particular law in your family. <laughs> Maraba Shakata. Today, that law will shatter by fire. Amen. That law will catch fire. Amen. Stand up and shake your body and shut fire. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fire, yeah, 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 yeah. Lift your hand and speak. Oh Lord. Oh Lord. Any negative law. Any negative law. Existing in my family. Existing in my family. From generation to generation. From generation to generation. I command that law. I command that law. To scatter. To scatter. To scatter. To scatter. To scatter. To scatter. In the Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Shake your body and shut fire. Sit down like a king. Open the book of Matthew 2, 7 to 8, past. Law. Law. Your great-grandfather had a memory loss. Your grandfather had a memory loss before he died. Now your father had a memory loss. <laughs> if you don't break it today, you will have a memory loss. To fear. Uh huh. So Herod called the visitors from the east to a secret meeting and found out from them the exact time the star had appeared. To eight. Then he sent them to Bethlehem with these instructions. Go and make a careful search for the child. And when you find him, let me know, so that I too may go and worship him. Daniel chapter 3, verse 8 to 12, fast. Daniel 3, 8 to 12. It was then that some Babylonians took the opportunity to denounce the Jews. They said to King Nebuchadnezzar, May your majesty live forever. Your majesty has issued an order. Your majesty has issued an order. That is a law. That as soon as the music starts, as soon as the music starts, everyone is to bow down. Everybody must bow down. And worship the gold statue. And worship the gold statues. And that anyone who does not bow down, 
And the Lord said that anyone who does not bow down and worship it, and worship it is to be thrown into a blazing furnace. There are some Jews whom you put in charge of the province of Babylon. There are three boys who has disobeyed this law. Because after this program, that negative law in your family must be disobeyed. Amen. Your family will begin to disobey that law. Amen. That law of late marriage in your family for the first time will be disobeyed. Amen. That law of rising and falling must be disobeyed. Amen. Are you ready to disobey it? Yes, sir. Uh-huh. Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, who are disobeying your majesty's order? They are disobeying the law. They do not worship your God. They did not worship your God. Or bow down to the statue you set Or bow down to the statues. After that, uh -huh. the king flew into a rage uh -huh. and ordered the three men to be brought before him. Mm -hmm. He said to them, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, is it true that you refuse to worship my God and to bow down to the gold statue I have set up? Mm -hmm. Now then, as soon as you hear the sound of the trumpets, oboes, lyres, Zetas, harps, and all the other instruments. Bow down and worship the statue. You must now, because that is the order. If you do not, you will immediately be thrown into a blazing furnace. Mm -hmm. Do you think there is any God who can save you? Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego answered, Your Majesty, we will not try to defend ourselves. If the God whom we serve is able to save us from the blazing furnace and from your power, then he will. But even if he doesn't, your majesty, your majesty may be sure that we will not worship your God. We will never. And we will not bow down to the gold statue that you have set up. Then Nebuchadnezzar lost his temper and his face turned red with anger at Shadrach. Meshach and Abednego. So he ordered the furnace to be heated seven times hotter than usual. And he commanded the strongest men in his army to tie the three men up and throw them into the blazing furnace. So they tied them up, fully dressed, shirts, robes, caps and all, and threw them into the blazing furnace. Now, because the king had given strict orders for the furnace to be made extremely hot, the flames burned up the guards who took the men to the, the fire. The fire consumed those men that, that threw them into the fire. Because after this program, the fire will consume those that are trying to destroy you. Amen! Do you know what the Bible is saying here? There is three young men. One is Shadrach. One is Meshach. One is Abednego. They are three bigger boys. They are three radical boys. They are three radical boys in God. Today, what we used to describe bigger boys is those that do sagging. Showing the boxer of 150 naira. That is what we used to describe the bigger boys. The bigger boys are those who stand with God, who know their God. The Bible says, those who know their God shall be strong. They shall do exploit. Shadrach, Mishan, and Abednego, they know their God. They know that God is powerful. They know that their God can do all things. Nothing is impossible. And they refuse to obey the order. That is order that you will refuse to obey from today. That order that everybody in your family is wretched and you want to be wretched, that order will be disobeyed today. Amen. I don't know that order. They told you that is existing law. There is existing order in this family. Everybody die premature. You will tell them, for me, I must, my spirit, flesh, and soul must disobey that order. Because the Bible says, when perfect come, imperfect will disappear. The Bible says, he that come from above is above all. Am I speaking to somebody? Yes, sir. Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. They said we can never bow down. 
They went and gossiped to the king. There are three men that refused to obey the law. And they are Shadrach, Meshach, and the Badnego. And the king, he said, brought, bring them. And they brought Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego in face to face to the king. And the king asked them, is that true that three of you have refused to obey the altar, obey the law, oh, to worship the gold statue I set up? The, the boys, the three big boys said to the king, may your majesty leave. Yes, yes. We can never, we have disobeyed the other. We can never worship this gold statue you set up because we have a God we worship. And the, we know the law, that the law required that anyone who did not worship the God will be put into the fire. We know. Shadrach and, and Meshach and said to them, said to the king, even if our God will not save us, O oh king, hear it from us, not gossip. We will never bow down to worship the gold statue you set up. Immediately, king heard this. King was mad. Arab king was go and make the fire seven times hotter, seven times hotter, and tie this man, tie them from head to toe. They went and made the fire seven times hotter, and he commanded the seven strongest men to lift three of them up and throw them into a burning fire. But uh, they don't know that something is about to happen. Seven strongest men lifted these three bigger boys up. As they went to throw them, they throw them. Manu's work consumed the fire, consumed the seven men. But the three young men in the fire was there. King, he came out to look. King, he said, "Is that no three people? I order you, men. I order to be put in the fire. Why do I see the fourth one? The fourth one. There are four. I am seeing four men. No longer three. I see four men. No longer three. I see four men. No longer three. And the fourth man look like angel. I don't know the battle you are into. The fourth man will show forth. 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 Shake that person now. Tell that person, the fourth man will show up in your life. The fourth man will show up in your life. I said, take good that person and tell that person, the fourth man will show up. The fourth man will show up. I said, take good, take good, take good, take good, take Take good. Many a young piano do her own. See, the fourth man will show forth. The fourth man will show forth. In your case. In your case. If you agree, hot, give somebody high ten. After this program, <laughs> the fourth man will show forth in your business. Amen. The fourth man will show forth in your family. Amen. You have been fighting this battle for a long time. Get ready for the fourth man. Amen. If you are going to the embassy for now, you may think it's business as usual. The fourth man will accompany you. Amen. Wherever you are going from now, you will see this fourth man. Amen. This fourth man will look like angel. Amen. This fourth man will look like a spirit. Amen. He will accompany you. Amen. It's no longer your battle from today. Yes, sir. If you better be shaking your body and shout fire. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fire. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, the memory is in Abia. Right on, sir. Read Daniel chapter 6, 4 to 13, fast. Daniel chapter 6, 4 to 13, fast. Then the other supervisors and the governors tried to find something wrong with the way Daniel administered the empire. The way Daniel will live, king like Daniel. They were used, looking for something to accuse Daniel of. They were looking for what, what can we use to trap Daniel. Daniel has won the favor of the king. What can we use to trap Daniel? Uh -huh. But they couldn't because Daniel was reliable and did not do anything wrong or dishonest. Ask that person, are you reliable in your office? Are you reliable, reliable in your, in your office? office? Even in your family, are you reliable? Even, Even in your family, family are, you are, you are you a cheater? Are you a cheater? A yahoo yahoo. A yahoo yahoo. A 419. A 419. 
Do you sleep with a married man? Do you sleep with married Do you sleep with a married woman? Do you sleep with married A girl you're supposed to have. A girl you're supposed to have. Are you taking advantage of her? Are you taking advantage of her? Are you reliable? Are you reliable? Continue. They said to each other, uh -huh. we are not going to find anything of which to accuse Daniel. We can't find anything to accuse him. Unless it is something in connection with his religion. The only thing we can use, because Daniel is an honest man. Daniel said the truth. Today you hardly hear the truth in the house of God. Even the members of the senior officers in the church, they are the ones that commit more atrocities. If you see where they are dragging position in the house of God, you think they are dragging position to work just to steal money from the church. I know a church that called me for prayer. Let me not mention the church. A man appointed for that year a man appointed for that year harvest and bazaar. Very an honest man in one of the church I will not mention. They, they pointed other people, other committee member. The man says, I will never have anything to do with the money of the church. The assistant and the others were telling him, this is how everybody used to do it. After all, we are pursuing the work now in the shop. The man who said, I was appointed for one year to be in charge of the harvest of this year. Why will I eat money that poor people are bringing to the church? Why will I do a preco? The man who says, no. They tried the man on every angle. No way. After seven days, the assistant told him, so far you don't want to cooperate. Last year, committee... Harvest, harvest committee, they chop very well. Some of them have cars, they have, they have house. You don't want us to chop. And after this, the church will never call us again because it's every year, new committee. This is my opportunity. So far, you don't want to cooperate. You will see, after seven days, the chairman of the bazaar of that church, Ramad, he wear pants on the streets. I was one of them they called. I was one of them that called in that church, in that parish. The, a good man, Ram, they saw him in the morning wearing pants. Pants, not even boxer. And immediately the man ran mad. The, the deputy was made the chairman. They started eating the money. When they even get to let me, the man was in psychiatric home until the year, that year. But I was, I never know. The sister came here. Same that the lepai he fell See, I jeno otara mea. We were still in this building, demolished building. A je a good man. What a jeno ota. I said, God. Let this madness go back to sender. I carry my head and drop on his head. Good people suffer so much. After this program, anybody punishing you for not reason, that person will carry your problem. Amen. That person will carry your problem. Amen. If you believe me, shake your body and shout fire. fire. Sit down like a king. Yes, sir. Most of the people you see in the house of God are not there to serve. They want a place they will eat. That is why you will see them hovering around the man of God. It's only few that are honest. But why won't somebody be cursed as I am now? The money of offering I used to see some dumb that come to drop five naira. How can I take such money for my personal? Actually, I mean, Amen. 
Amen. But look at Daniel was walking, but very honest. Daniel was very, they said, the guy is so reliable. He's not one of them that have me to how to eat church money. He's not one of them that used to betray the king. We hardly see honest people today. Even Anazir, what boy you were? There is a man I went to go and pray for his shop. I asked them to take me there in the night. They took me. A very rich man, but he doesn't understand himself again. I asked them to, around 11.30, 12 was when I went there. Before I get to his office, 12 midnight, the, he called army people, police, they were on the street. Nobody knows it was me. I entered the office. I saw a sham that the boy put in the wardrobe. A small sham. Nobody sees it. Anytime the man enters his office, something will begin to happen to him. He will run away. He doesn't stay in his shop. The boy became the chairman. The boy is the one who building houses. But all God that have the money was suffering. Men of these days are wicked. Tap that person beside you. Ask him or her, are you a wicked person? Are you a wicked person? Give him the TV. Onye osikin. Criminals. Some of them have minonia, but they are thief. In the office where you are working, are you a thief? Look at that brother. Look at this. Are you a thief? Are you a thief? Look at the eyes of that person. See in your office, enjoy. That's the question. Amen. Do you know one of our committee during the time of Ifan uh, Yozo? One of our Sunday, most of you wouldn't know him. The guy doing very well. If he find he was here, he would know him. Sunday. But as I know him now. Mm -hmm. A man that have up to eight chops. Doing well. One day he came to my house. I said, brother, book my own has finished. I don't understand my business again. Eight chop. When I asked him to open his hand. He opened his hand. I noticed that his boys are the one finishing him. People are no longer reliable. I asked him to go and bring the eight boys. He went and brought. He have eight shop. More than 15 boys. He brought all of them. I was looking at their hands. This one, they have two vehicles. Move, rolling around Lagos, making money for you. This one, you are building house. That was how Augustine they recovered his vehicles. No attack. His attack was his voice. This is one of our committee for you to see how dangerous people are. After this program, anybody marching on your neck will go down. Amen. That amen suffers with Kochoko. Amen. Use your back and give that person a back. Use back, 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 back. Where you could get piano kunk here. Turn out to be a clever, beba. Yeah. Go up here. Turn out to me. Turn out to two of you. I'm going to kiss you here. that anybody walking against you will go down for yourself. Amen. Ask that person, are you reliable? Are you reliable? There is a, 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 a pastor that caught one day carrying cocaine, carrying Bible. Why can't we be reliable? Tell that person as you are sitting down, are you reliable? Are you reliable? In school, are you reliable? In school, are you reliable? In your office, are you reliable? In your office, are you reliable? Can people boast? Can people say, you see this girl, leave it for her. She's very honest.
they brought a book, a book for me in my, in our office. He was security man, stealing. And then he had a brother book and ah, oh yeah, be hana, brother book. O father be fechuku. You, 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 you. After the preaching, are you honest? Ne read, read, read. Ni ana bem ni sabela. Uh huh. Captain Hakun one. Read. Oche fole Daniel ebem nago. Uh huh. So they went to see the king and said, King Darius, may your majesty live forever. Uh huh. All of us who administer your empire, the supervisors, the governors, the lieutenants, governors, and the other officials have agreed that your majesty should issue an order and enforce it strictly. Give orders that for 30 days, no one be permitted to request anything from any god or from any human being except from your majesty. Anyone who violates this order is to be thrown into a pit filled with lions. So let your majesty issue this order and sign it. And it will be in force. A law of the Medes and Persians which cannot be changed. And so King Darius signed the order. When Daniel learned that the order had been signed, he went home. In an upstairs room of his house, there were windows that faced toward Jerusalem. There, just as he had always done, he knelt down at the open windows and prayed to God three times a day. He would always pray to God three times a day. Mm -hmm. And the law was that nobody should pray to God except the, 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 the so-called gods set up by king. When Daniel's enemies observed him praying to God, uh -huh. all of them went together to the king to accuse Daniel. They said, Your majesty, you signed an order that for the next 30 days, anyone who requested anything from any god or from any human being except you, would be thrown into a pit filled with lions. The king replied, Yes, that is a strict order, a law of the Medes. That is a law. Of the Medes and Persians, which cannot be changed. Then they said to the king, Daniel, one of the exiles from Judah, does not respect your majesty or obey the order you issued. He prays regularly. Three times a day. And that was the offense of Daniel. When the king heard this, he was upset and did his best to find some way to rescue Daniel. He kept trying until sun shine. The, the enemy came. Uh, it's okay. The, Daniel's enemy came back and said to the king, we saw him. You have given the order. Why did they went to king for that order? They went to king because of the Daniel. They want to use something to Nail Daniel on the cross because Daniel is honest man was so honest. Today we hardly have honest people. Even in the church, no honesty. Even in the outside there, in the field, corruption walks on two legs. Every office you enter, you must see corrupt people. This country, most of the time, when people are blaming people on the top, yes, they should be blamed. But check yourself in the area where you are, leader. Are you not corrupt? You will go to airport. Sometimes we normally blame the presidents, governors. Yes, we should blame them. But go to airport. If you don't settle if your fellow citizens, then we know you have visa. If you don't settle and settle, you can miss, they will delay you until you miss your flight. 
They don't care. Especially if it's a virgin, you just got visa. You will settle different offices. Some boys have been settling and settling until they miss their flight. Corruption. Go to our university today. So many students, they have refused to graduate them because they refuse to sleep with some lecturers. Go to some offices today. Are we talking about church? Go to uh, you, our uniform men and women. You got a hand and call. For the uniform men, and I guess you were Hebrew PS. You want to hide the men, and he had them, man. POS. I could sing, I sing, what a little POS. Messa, Messa, Fansa. Oh, the Ebu. Which area is not corrupt? Which area? Just tell me the area that is not corrupt. Our universities. Now, secret court is ready. Small, small boys, court, 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 court. Even primary school, secondary school, court. Girlfriend, girlfriend. Hey, you hardly see any virgin now. Every, with this hardship. Oh, <laughs> Every area is corrupt. Let me use what I have to get what I want to. They are ready to sleep with you. They don't care whether you're a married man or not. So far, you give them 5,000, 10,000 to go and eat. Condom their handbag. Corruption works on two legs. Uh, every time our president is bad, our governor, senators, are you not bad in your area? How are you managing the small position you have? Just that you have a shop in Idumata. You refuse to increase the salary of your girl because she refused not to sleep with you. Just your sex girl. That small girl, you know, she doesn't have a father and mother. The only condition before you can help her is that you'll be sleeping with her. And tomorrow you are, you are blaming the president of Nigeria. Corruption works with the two legs. Now everybody is doing their breasts. What are they doing this breast for? So that, it, because boys are no longer paying attention to small, small ones. So the girls, girls want to, they want to re-strategize. They want to put gear too. Oje zome or maybe oto. Corruption. Oh, my, they are doing their bomb bomb. The bomb bomb that God gave you, the way it is, you are original of whom you are. You want to go and do it just to get the attention of boys. I, I don't understand. For how many years? Old age is coming up. Mbukwa ye, bidonere. Magos and Apotel. And one, a baby, my one, a baby. The Quarachine Caca. Daniel, they trap Daniel down. The only way they can trap Daniel down well, is because of his religion. The guy is honest. Sometimes I'll be asking God, where are the honest people again in our time? The reason why you see our states so bad, different states, is because of honesty. When you see honest 
man on the position. The Bible says when the righteous is on the throne, people celebrate, people rejoice. And they went to king and met law. After this program, anybody making any law just to trap you down, that person will be disgraced and exposed. Amen. Am I speaking to somebody? Yes, sir. They make law just to get Daniel down. And they went to king and says, made a law that any man or woman that pray to any God except the one we are worshiping here will be thrown into the den filled with a lions. They made that law. They went to king just to trap Daniel. And it happened the way they planned. After the law, they saw Daniel praying. They went to the king and said to him, somebody has violated the law. Somebody has violated the law. We saw him praying. And, then, and the king loved Daniel so much. King looked for opportunity to save Daniel. They keep reminding him that what is written is written. King have no option than to allow them to throw Daniel in the pit filled with the lions. But before they throw Daniel, the, 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 the senior lion of the tribe of Judah has communicated to the lions, your brother is coming. When your brother come, just play with him. Oh, the lions in the dem say, oh, we are happy that very soon we are going to welcome our senior brother. Before they throw Daniel, the Bible says Daniel was playing with the lions. Daniel was touching their head. How many times have you been here? Daniel was touching them. After this program, the angels will come for your rescue. Amen. Stand up and shake your hand and shout, fire! fire! Sit down like a king. Yes, sir. Am I speaking to somebody here? Yes, sir. And the Daniel King, the Bible says, that night, King could not sleep because he loved Daniel so much. Early in the morning, King was the first that went to the, the pit. He looked down. He saw Daniel. He said, oh, Daniel, oh, man of God. So the God whom you truly serve saved you. Daniel from the pit said to the king, God whom I serve saved me because he knows I am innocent. He knows I love you, the king. And immediately, king ordered Daniel to be brought out. They brought him out. You are coming out of any pit of sorrow. Amen. Pit of late marriage. Amen. Pit of rising and falling. Amen. Pit of monkey that over with the show. You are coming out. Amen. Somebody shout, I am, I am coming out. I cannot hear you. I am coming out. From the pit of sorrow. From the pit of sorrow. I am coming out. From the pit of disappointment. I am coming out. From the pit of monkey that over with the show. From the pit of monkey that over with the show. I am coming out. I am coming out. From the pit of late marriage. I am coming out. Out. I am coming out. And what happened? Immediately, they brought Daniel out gloriously because somebody is going to come out gloriously. Amen. Do you know what the king said? King says, Now, all those people that accused Daniel, remember that was not part of the order. The order was not that when you accuse somebody and they throw the person, that you should be all, another order to put those that accuse him. There was no order. But that day, the king has to do something contrary by the law. He said, let those men that put Daniel, that accused Daniel, let them and their wife and their children be thrown back to the pits of liar. And the Bible says, before they throw them there, the liar used them for breakfast lunch and dinner. I don't know those who are kissing you. I don't know those fighting against you. Fire. I don't know those walking against you. Fire. I don't know those walking against you. Fire. Those waging war against you. Fire. Lions, we use them for breakfast. Amen. Lion of destruction, we destroy them. Amen. 
Are you ready for what I'm going to tell you now? Yes, sir. Are you sure you are ready? Yes, sir. Are you sure you are ready? Yes, sir. Are you ready? Yes, sir. Are you ready for freedom? Yes. Are you ready? Yes, sir. One Jump up wherever you are. You are born in 14th of June. Jump up and shout, I am celebrating. I am celebrating. Is somebody ready for favor? Yes, sir. Well, yeah, okay, look, the law is broken today. Amen. The law is broken. Amen. The law. Amen. The law. Amen. That law in your family. That law holding you captive. Well, yeah, okay, look, speak after me. Lord Jesus. Lord, Lord Jesus. Jesus. Any negative law, any, any negative, negative law, law, any deity, any deity, any agreement with shrine, any agreement with shrine, with my maternal father and mother, with my maternal father and mother, and my paternal father and mothers, and my paternal father and mothers, any law, any law, they established, established, that is affecting us today, that is affecting us today. By the power in the name of Jesus. By the power in the name of Jesus. By the power in the blood of Jesus. By the power in the blood of Jesus. Let that door, law. Let that 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 law. Be lifted. Clap your hand and begin to pray now. By my father, my father, my Somebody is not praying. I come against it by fire. Let that law be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Let that law be destroyed. Let that law be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Let that law be cancelled in the name of Jesus. Let that law be cancelled in the name of Jesus. Every law from my own side, every law from my other side, every law from my other side, every law from my own side, every law from my one side. No, you are not doing it today. Be destroyed. 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 Destroy it affecting my family. We shatter you today. Any law in my we family. Destroy you today. Law of late you marriage. Law. law of late Stand marriage. Fire. Law of failure. Fire. Law of rising and falling. Fire. 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 Mali Brokoto Shini. You evil law. Mali Bragalabasha. No, you need other law. You evil law. From my father's Bragalabasha. No, you need other law. You evil law. From my mother's side. Stopping me. Stopping my family. Stopping me. Stopping my blessings. Stopping my life. Today, be destroyed by fire. 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 By fire, 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 that law keeping you one place. That ancestral law, 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 ancestral law. My mama shall be in my sacrament. My mama shall be in my sacrament. My mama shall be in my sacrament. We are free to be 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 We I 
lose my family. Let that ancestral law be destroyed in the Holy Ghost. 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 This is family breaking our causes. Lift ah. your hand in your family. <laughs> Lift your hand in your family. Marababasha. Vision that family you come from. It's a double family. First of all, vision your maternal side. Fire. Have you been in your maternal side? 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 Where your mother come from? Where your mother come from? Where your mother come from? Speak out to me, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Whatever. Whatever. I hear it. I hear it from my maternal side. Whatever. Whatever. My family hear it. My brothers hear it. My brothers hear it from my maternal side. I shall begin to pray. I shall begin to pray. Let the angels move there. Let the angels move and destroy it. Destroy. Clap your hand and begin to pray. Oh Lord. My father, 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 my Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. In my paternal side. In my paternal side. Any agreement. Any agreement. With my ancestors. With my ancestors. Agreement. Agreement. With the serpent. With the serpent. Any agreement. Any agreement. Any agreement. Any agreement. From my paternal side. 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 Lord, let the child be broken. Let the child be destroyed. Break, 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 break. Clap your hand. Be destroyed. Be destroyed. Any broken, any power, any break, 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 break. Let the child be broken. Break, let the child be broken. Break it off, cast it. 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 Fire! 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 Fire!
We are dealing from your patana and matana. Well, you are Lord. Lord. Any spirit in my body that have taken over my body, taken over my body. Any, covenant any covenant I entered into, I entered into with my friends, with my friends, with my mother, with my, mother. With my father, with my father. Covenant, covenant, marine covenant, marine covenant, marine covenant, covenant. 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 Lord, I separate myself. I separate myself. Now, now. clap your hands. Begin to separate yourself. Every shakata. Holy Mama Shaka, Saka Tolibra, separate yourself, separate yourself from Marine, 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 Separate, 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 you are into, 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 you are into separation, 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 separation by fire. Covenant is broken. Covenant is broken. Covenant is broken. Break. Break. Every cause. Every parental cause. Break it right now. Break every chain. 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 Break. 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 Lift that hand up now. Breathe in. Every chain is broken. Amen. Every cause is broken. Amen. Every, in these 20 days, we are dealing with whatever, dealing with you. So far, it's from any man, any common, any angle. There will be... Ooh, reversal of captivity. Amen. There will be reversal of captivity. Amen. There will be reversal of captivity. Amen. Amen. Reversal of captivity. Amen. Everything going on now, let it work against your enemy. Amen. As you are receiving freedom, may your enemy begin to go into bondage. Amen. Let the fire of Nebuchadnezzar destroy them. Hey, in the Holy Ghost. Will you come in? Breathe in. Oh, the Holy Spirit is coming. The gentle spirit of God. The gentle spirit. The gentle dove. The gentle spirit. The gentle spirit. The gentle spirit. The gentle spirit, 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 spirit of freedom, 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 
Spirit of freedom. 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 Abela, Abela, this is mad. Pa! Anywhere, Abia. Anywhere, Abia. Anywhere, Abia. Only in Lana Zapata. Only in Lana Zapata. A spirit of freedom, Abia. In Second Corinthians 3 17, where the Holy Ghost is, that is liberty. Liberty in your family. Amen. Liberty in your family. Amen. Liberty in your family. Amen. I can imagine going on a bone water. Amen. Any hand holding your business is hereby destroyed. Amen. On your candle now. That and candle will have the names of your family, life or death. Well, yeah, yeah. 20 days here, don't fail Zion program. <laughs> 20 days here, somebody yoke will be broken. Amen. Even from this night, you begin to hear stories. You will begin to hear stories. Amen. You will begin to hear good news. Amen. Your brother that have never called for a long time will begin to call. Amen. Orochi, show liberation candle. Then I will open up the candle. Boy, how cool. Go and look for liberation candle tomorrow again Sunday. On this one you have now. Jesus brings the yoke. By the Holy Ghost and power. Just how the prophet says. This is the name of the letter. God is born. By the anointing, Jesus prays for you. It's not by mind. It's not by mind. It's, it's not by power. It's not by power. I my spirit faith alone. It's not by mind. It's not by mind. It's not by power. It's not by power. Against your mother. Ay, 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 ay. 
Your brothers in a village. Any foundational case. Scatter in the Holy Ghost. 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 Holy Ghost fire, 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 Oh, Jimmy, 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 Jimmy,
Yeah! 
Jehovah, check the light, Jehovah. Where are the names in that picture? Shout that step again. Shout the names again. So sit down on your chair. It is a pity that some of you don't understand the liberation going on in these 20 days. Make sure you have your candle written the name of every member of your family, life or death. If one is not enough to cover all of them, write it on the two. I don't want to see the picture of your family on your phone. Print it out. Before these 20 days, you will see something that will happen in your family. Hey! <laughs> it's a family prayer. Today's topic is that any law in your family is hereby destroyed. Amen. As you sit down, wave that hand. Wave that picture. Oof. Yemuli boy, Nabia, you like Zion too much. Stand up. Who do you have in abroad? Your mom is in abroad. My mother and my sister. Uh, yeah, uh, something new will happen in your family. Amen. Now come, stand up. Orole Mbeje, teacher. Uh, time of sorrow is over. Amen. Malabashana. Lobrogodoshana. You know, for a long time, it's as if you are a failure. Eh? Yes. Everything that comes to your hand, something must happen. Of course, it's true. 
your family yoke is broken. Hey. Tell your mom in abroad, she's, she has a good heart and she will grow old. The yoke upon you is destroyed. Amen. Very soon, you will be flying in and out. Amen. <laughs> your matter is settled. Amen. Bring him up. Una amaro how serious? Can be say baba a kolo coffee. He make offer. For you to know that I am interested in you in your freedom than offering. Because I know God has given me what he takes. And that is why I'm here. The more I stand, the, the more deliverance comes to the people. <laughs> now get ready. Look at my eyes. How many brothers do your mom have? How many sons? And when can we run one? Get on now. Can you bet the woman no more than one? Yeah, yeah. You have to come. Oh, I am when things will turn around. And it will affect every member of the family. So this is not the first or second. This family breaking of causes prayer. Anybody that is due to travel, fourth man will follow you from now. Hey, Amen. Everybody must not be touched to be saved. Don't worry. Everybody will not be touched. That will be no a banquet. I pray for you before, right? Stand up. Bless. You're blessed. But you're having disappointment. You're very blessed, but you're having disappointment. Oh. Then I got it around. Sit one place. No more money. I'm sorry. 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 I'm Huh? Yes, sir. You have to give your life to Christ. You have made a lot of mistakes. Huh? Yes, sir. You made a lot of mistakes. But God is going to beautify you. Amen. Get ready for beautification. Amen. No, no, no. Come. Did you do that? Yes, sir. The mother never worry. We don't even be set free. Amen. I see who saw Kachine Kebi. The mother never worry. If you stop from now, I see testimony coming. Happy Aka. Your yoke is broken Amen. in the name of J E S U S. Jesus. Agamanoya, 
There is a boy here. You pregnanted a blind girl. And you are not with that blind girl. That day, she was trying to tell you that she's not interested. But you push. If you don't come out, I see you going mad that nobody can cure. If you are the guy that pregnanted a blind, innocent girl, I want to see you now. Don't be ashamed. Come out. If you want to experience this liberation we are talking. If I count two and you are ashamed, if you come to meet me again, of course, you know, you may not have the opportunity of seeing me. If you are extremely back, wrong, so that your yoke will be broken. Run to me. Run to me. Run to me. I am living. And I see you having problem. If the person is ashamed, then I will leave. You uh, in this ground, we're all supporter. We're also Gesoki, Ogesabota, Iwosi, Rambaraki, Asina, Uwadu Majugi, Amaraki. Nida, where is that girl now? Where is the girl now? Where is she? Can the girl or not? Where is their village? Huh? Nai Ibu. Huh? Where do you come from? Huh? Benue. Benue. You sleep with a new girl. Huh? Yes. And you know she's blind. <laughs> Where for camera? Christian, take this boy to the altar. If I'm treating it now, it will take my time. Take him. Go to the altar and wait for me. Glory, honor, power to the one who reigns. Do you have a child? Sister, Sister, do you have a child? Why? If I'm talking to people, they are scared. Do you have a child? Yes. Okay, many people don't know. People don't know. Talk to me, I will leave you. Huh? Yes. They are not, people are not aware. Why are you shy? If you want to marry, won't you tell the man? Huh? I will. Oh, you don't feel the way, you are not going, bye-bye. Blessings and a praise to the one who reigns is angel. Two of you stand up. Nabiano said it. Ian, where's the way go? Be careful with women. Here we go too much. I have too much money. <laughs> what am the boy? He the book can go forever. Garage no longer show. Here we see go. Say I don't put it up here. 
That's what I'm this way. Kebe mama gino. Biko, the message is saying that there is another person. This one that came out now is not even the one that have that message. He's involved, but not even the one. There is a main guy that destroyed the West of a blind crying girl. If you don't come out, you will have problem that no man will kill. And the voice is coming to me now. The other boy may have that issue, but he's not even the one I'm hearing now. The one you pray for is not even the one that have that message. So wherever you are, come out. Heaven. Now get on to it. As you wave these pictures, may your family yoke be broken. Amen. Sister, can you hold me? I'll get you ready. Bring that sister up. Sit down. Hmm? Now, where is your husband? Kebu Mungeno. I set you free from Marine Covenant. Happy Aka. In the name of J E S U S. Jesus. Don't disturb. Just calm down. Ebenezer, 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 my soul of hell will live by my hand. Hey, well, in this family you come from, a kitchen. where is the picture of your own family? I got some and I had Jesus. Hey, man. From today, this family yoke is broken. Amen. 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 Holy Ghost, 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 Holy Ghost. I want many call. Sister Mini, be set free. Amen. Be set free. Amen. Yeah, just watch. How about you gonna marry Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh yeah, Jia. Uh huh. She can be able to stay comfortably with any man. She may, would the mother find it difficult to marry? And even if they're married, Trouble, trouble, trouble in the marriage. Now, are you married or single? Uh, uh, this kind of person hardly marry. They hardly marry. Now, come. Let me find out. She hardly marry because of the kind of spirit in her. Oh, yeah, can you speak to me? Are you single or married? Huh? Huh? Oh. Huh? Once again, single. single. 
What did I say? On the Kutaminia Agua Agua, but the Elema Agua Agua Buere Agua Buere Isaiah 27, verse 1. On that day, on that day, the Lord with a sharp sword we cut off the head of Neviathan. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, let her go in the name of J E S U S G. Now, we look what I know, Lele. Mention him, Nemumba, sister, we get married. Amen. Ne, Mesa Siana, you will see her coming to give testimony. On a low, low. Anywhere, Chatalia. Who is the next that will be remembered today? The world, sir. Wave that to your family picture. Sister, get ready for testimony. Amen. Which state do you come from? Anambra. Anambra. Uh huh. Get ready. <laughs> As a wine. And look at the wine. May the Lord preserve your children. Amen. Your children. Don't tell me you. I have no good taste in wine. But good deal. Imonyo. I'm wondering. Imonyo. But anything you want. Happy Aka. Happy Aka. May the Lord bless the siblings. Will you have to shout fire? Fire. That so many boys will not be sleeping with a man, a woman, until they marry. Many of them will give testimony. Amen. Amen. The main person that slept with that blind girl, I put a bed there. Holy Ghost, 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 don't enter into anybody. Oh, yeah. Go. Holy Ghost. Fire. 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 Let her go. J E S U S G. Well, yeah, kill. I set you free. Young lady, be set free. Lose your hold. Amen. In the name of J E S U S. She doesn't sleep well at night. Many people have python in their womb. Umuoke J N E D no ha. No rebe no. In a boss, or another in each Be set free. Amen. Will you kill the shot fire? Fire. Many business sit around. After this program, business here coolly. Amen.
Olende business in Hadarata. Business in Madarata. Kajikuli Toto. Amen. Who am I speaking to? I'm the one, sir. No, you are set free. Amen. You are set free. Amen. Fair picture I have. Fair. Devine Abron Kine fed this picture. Not rather. As you wave this picture. Let your yoke be broken. Amen. 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 Victor, 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 Victor. Flash back, flash inside, flash the land. You can remember? You can remember? Then I cannot talk to you. I can't talk to you. Uh, freedom. Oh, yeah, where's the go? I want to end up with Victor. You're not quiet. Oh, you didn't care. You didn't care. And I wear Victor long ago. Long ago. Oh, but I'm going to show. But your, your yoke is broken. Amen. Yeah, where's the go? Get ready. Ne, ne stand up. Who brought you here? How long have you been coming? Face say this picture. On one way and up, she care. Ole we corobia dinoro wine urish Kebono Yemeni Fere Oh, when he had a woman, oh, when I bought chickens here, going on a bought chickens here. Oh, when I am a man on a psychiatric home, Culiotto, Dolite, Dolite, Sister Hill. Today, the satanic yoke in this area is destroyed. Amen. Noreba Hino, Noreba Hino, Bua, Saraba, Akende, Lebro, Shinda, Kende, Purubo Shinda, Omoroyana, Pochine, Du. He gonna bury a ground because of your family situation. Bury a ground. I want to see you. I want to see the one. Also. There will be good news. 
Oh, we hear that she men on Ugama. Oh, we are not watching a Dugana burial ground. Nabia, you are chin a do. Huh? Yes, sir. You went to a burial ground. Huh? Huh? Yes, sir. You know, since you went to a burial ground, things became worse. Am I speaking to him? You know, no, we fair. Huh? No, no, no. That since you went to Beria Grand, things became worse. Eh? Yes, Have I talked to you before? I'm going to go it before. No, sir. I'm a more evil. No, sir. Today, your yoke is broken. Amen. Amen. On Sunday, we are starting on time. By 12, I'm on the stage on Sunday. On Sunday, I'm going to throw out Tisha. I'm going to Tisha. May the Lord set you free. Amen. In the name of J E S U S. Jesus. Chine, you will not die. You are losing your ear. You are losing your eyes. Everything is not. This is everything is scattered. But today, even any huchine koki care. Everything will change for you. Amen. The park again. Nde che frugi ya che tazingi. Amen. The one on Sunday, I have that. For good reason, I get that picture. For that picture, for see you can wave it. Shout their name, say again. First year, you can shout their names again. Shout their names. Shout their names. Ngesogi, onyeza puta, imuti rambaraki, asina uwadi majuki. Be set free. Amen. Sunday, twelve o'clock. I'm on my altar. Who knows what you to I a bit of teacher from twelve. In a bit, what am I the thirty? Sister, be set free. J E S U S. Jesus. On your teacher. Of road. Power. I'm wearing my cape everywhere. Power. And then you grab all them. The spirit is calling me now. The spirit is calling me. 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 The spirit. Okay, mona, I'm going The spirit is calling me. It's all over. It's moving me. It's moving me around. It's moving me around. It's moving me around. It's all over me. Oh, it's moving me around. Ah, it's moving me around. It's all over me. It's moving me around. Oh, it's moving me around. Ah, it's moving me around. Ah, it's all over me. Yeah, it's pushing me around. I love them. Of Galilee. Of Galilee. He has done so very much for me. 
very much for me. He has forgiven me all my sins. I thank the Holy Ghost. I love the man. Case is settled. <laughs> I see a business that will shock you. It runs in millions. You are coming to Zion for testimony. The matter is settled. All over the world, the spirit is moving. All over the world, as the prophet said it should be. All over the world. There is a mighty revelation oh. and the glory of the Lord I, as the, the water covered the sea. Wave your hand right now as the spirit is moving. Wave your picture right now as the prophet said it should be. Wave your picture right now. There is a mighty revelation as the glory of the Lord as the water cover the sea. Wave your picture right now. The spirit is moving. Wave your picture right now as the prophet said it should be. Wave your picture right now. There is a mighty revelation as the glory of the Lord as the water cover the sea. Wave your picture right now. There is deliverance in your family. Wave your picture right now as the prophet said it should be. Wave your picture right now. There's a mighty revelation as the glory of the Lord as the water covered the sea. As you wave this picture, there is deliverance in your family. Amen. 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 Is in Ola today there is deliverance? Amen. Oh, I am watching my time. 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 On Sunday, we are starting by 12. I will be on the stage on time. Don't worry. The people from the back here, 
I am starting from here on Sunday. I'm going to wave that picture. Wave your picture. Shout the name of your people again. Lift your water, lift your offerings. Chafi maka kanjua Unyake 
boti oroma oroma chuku kogari galiru ipuri wadi chuku mba you go with yourself oh If you know you are crossing the road, crossing express, please sleep here early in the morning. You will go. I will come there and stay with you. We are going to do midnight prayer there together. Yay. I cover you, blood of Jesus. Blood of Jesus. In the name of the Father, Son, Son and, the and the Holy Spirit. Spirit. On Sunday, we will start on time and close on time. Remember that there is 11 p.m. program today. Please, those that want to partner with the Seraphic Combs Foundation should go to their stand in front of the altar by the right side. If you want to partner with the Seraphic Combs Foundation, please go to their stand, pick up a form, drop two passport photograph, which will be used one. Manuel, we're not. 